Hey, what's up, guys? What's up, Gnome? Gnome with the 500 biddies. Let's go. Thank you, Gnome. Appreciate that, Gnome. Zolan was mom for the next 30 years, so deal with it. <laughs> no problem. I didn't even really read it. No biggie, no biggie. But I, uh, I will say, though, I was, uh, like 30 seconds late. And it is deserved, and I should not be chastised for that, because I did you a favor by deleting your message. So, I was delayed a few seconds doing my stretches and stuff, so... Well, I didn't stretch, actually. I had to roll my back. Thank you. Thank you, Dome. And I will overlook yours. So we're even. Let's go. What's really funny is, uh, every single time I move this desk, I swear to Jesus, um... The little P here is the desk. Like, the, the motor running. And she comes running. She takes it as a sign to come up on the desk. Like, as soon as I hit the button, I saw her right outside my door. Like, right outside my office. I'm pretty sure she was, like, upstairs sleeping. And as soon as she heard my chair move, it's just... Yeah. So, I will have to sit down soon. Because I'm sure she's probably... Yep, there she is. Speak of the devil. Hey, baby. Hey, baby. Don't worry, I'll stand again after this. After she gets off. Hey, baby. Hey, baby. Oh my god, these treats, bro. They're so small. I have to, like... Cut them so small now. I need to make more. I need like a machine that can cut her treats in uh, in halves or quarters for me because it sucks. Pill cutting, if anybody has pill cut before, it sucks. It's basically the same. I mean, I do have the pill cutter thing, but uh, it does not, it's not helpful. It still sucks really bad. It is not fun standing at the kitchen covering over the counter for like an hour and a half cutting and this is the amount that I got. It sucks. But we do it all for you, little pea. Little pea got like food on her eyeball this morning. Oh my god. Like, actually in her eye, and I had to pick it out very carefully, of course. Very carefully, of course. She keeps doing this now, now that she has no teeth. She just keep, keeps doing that. She basically just flips food up with her tongue. She never used to do this, and she never used to be, um, like a messy eater, either. When she had teeth. But now that she doesn't have teeth, it just goes everywhere. Like, the food is, like, outside of a bowl on the floor so now we, get, we use a mat it's just she sometimes has it like on her uh, like her forehead like above her eye sometimes under her eye and now in her eye oh my god and then same thing with like the litter though like the same thing with the litter I don't know why like the litter gets on her nose sometimes I don't know why it never used to be like this crazy 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 Okay, so I have reduced the loot modifier for the game, for the server. So we will have less loot. So it will be more exciting to get stuff when we do get stuff. Uh, it was set to like 10. I don't know why, maybe some kind of like scum update changed it. But the default is one. We had it changed to 10 and I'm f very certain that I had it on three before. And, but I have it on five now, just to see. Oh my god, I forgot to ch turn on the fan. Be right back, it's really good hot. I blame the no fan on Gnome, because I had to delete his message. <sighs> okay, 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 okay. Okay, 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 let's go. <laughs> Uh, all right, I don't see any cargo drops right now. So we'll wait for the next one. Yep. Next time though, Gnome, uh, just make sure you drop the credit card number though, instead of other information. Your credit card, expiration, your name, the CCV. You know the drill, you know the drill.
wonder if I've harvested this before. If it will no longer get me anything, yield me anything. Probably not, right? Oh, shit! Seven broccolis? What? Wow. Seven broccolis just in one plant? Holy crap. Last time I only got one out of these nine plants. <laughs> out of all nine, I got one last time. Okay. What about these? Cucumbers. The cucumbers do not look good. Is it windy? Sounds windy. Each block is searchable? Yeah, each block is a plant. It's one plant per block. So like one plant, one plant, one plant, one, 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 etc. So each one is a separate plant by itself. Which is why it makes us so hard to do this garden because it takes goddamn forever to do this garden. Because you have to do each one at a time. Uh, okay, so... This cucumber plant doesn't look good, right? It looks like it's like dying the color. <laughs> I'm gonna get rid of it. See, I have to destroy each plant. Oh, look how long it takes. It's like 40 or 50 seconds per one for planting it, which means destroying it is probably the same too. And then you have to do the same thing over again for planting, for watering, fertilizing, weeding. You have to do the exact same process for each one. Cargo drop in D3? Okay, we can go straight up. Straight up. Let's go. Let's go. Let's get out of here. Anything to get uh, out of uh, garden duty. boy yeah I'm gonna open this and they're gonna be right here I should have screwdrivers though, actually. Probably a good idea. Alright, I got screwdrivers. Off to D3. You know what? I want to build a watchtower. 
or something for our base so we can look out the uh, door before we go outside see if there's any puppets next time I think I might do that today then build a really tall watchtower or something So good news is uh, the dishwasher repair guys came today. Thank God. They came today and uh, they got our dishwasher fixed. Thank God. They actually showed up a lot quicker than I uh, expected them to. So, you know, we celebrated by uh, getting Chick-fil-A. <laughs> so we didn't actually use the, really use the dishwasher, but kind of got it running right now just to make sure but they did run it before they left uh, a couple times to make sure that it wasn't gonna leak water anymore spill water anymore so I think we're probably good to go thank god so happy so happy we got the dishwasher back hey, a little dock out here for fishing or something nice Is this car still one piece? I swear you just switched them out off stream. <laughs> no, I don't. I do not. I promise. I promise I don't. Well, the thing is, though, here you go, Rome. This, this is the thing. I am pretty sure little Pete pooped. It smells pretty bad right now. But I'm gonna go sco scoop up her poop right after I explain this to you. But no, I'm checking out. I'm pretty sure the, the cars are bugged. In that, if I slam into like a tree or something. It doesn't take off the health. The, the only way right now that I can wreck it is if I crash it into the ocean or like the river like Creepy Taco did the other day. That's the only way I can wreck it right now. Right now it is not taking any damage, like just slamming into things, it doesn't take damage. Flipping it over won't do anything either now anymore. It used to when these first came out, the cars came out, when these modular cars came out, but now when you flip them, you can flip them back over. So we should probably be pretty good still, but I haven't flipped one yet. I haven't flipped one yet recently. I know, so sorry, Creepy Taco, I know. The car allowed cost base is just the mini junkyard. Well, you better savor that, Creepy Taco, because I did, I did change the, uh, <laughs> the loot back down. I changed it to five though, Creepy Taco. I think we might drop it down to three, depending on how today goes. Today is kind of like the experiment day for that. But uh, yeah, all right, I'll be right back. I'm gonna check the litter. I think she she dropped, Little P dropped uh, hot logs. She definitely dropped hot logs. I can usually tell because it smells really bad because it comes into my office first 
And also because she meows like a maniac. Actually, when she does that. I don't know if she's trying to tell us that, hey, this shit smells, can someone scoop it up or what? But she definitely like gets the zoomies and she runs around like crazy and meows like a psychopath when she takes the poop. That's an odd mechanic, you hit puppets, you should take... Yeah, no, 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 it's not a mechanic, gnome. It's bugged. It's a bug. It's glitched. It's broken. It is definitely not a mechanic. It should not be like that, no. Nah, it's just broken. It, uh, the old, the old vehicles, when you hit puppets, you would take damage. When you hit things, you would take damage. This is just broken. I'm sure at some point, their next, like, big update or whatever, I'm sure it'll, they'll fix this. Definitely not a feature, it is just broken. Oh boy. Drop Hunter. Oh, crap, wrong way. Rip. been through this town before. Get the cargo drop. No puppets.
All right, let's see what we get. I hope we get uh, MREs. We'll get MREs. Or uh, medical supplies. Hazmat suit, really, even. Car battery? Force locks. We have no use for those, so I'm not gonna take those. Gold locks. Oh. Hmm. Majestic beer vodka. Bear vodka. Thievery. Wait. Food? Okay. No, not the best. Not the best food. Proxmine. Nice. One shot. So everything I need for the ump, except for the ump. Damn it. Oh, there's puppets. We drink while we're driving now. No. Well, while we're in the uh, Samabor, let's check out the city. Creek says something about uh, the Chinese shop being here. Uh, see if I can find where he said that was. D4 pad 3. D4 pad 3. Come from the west side. Well, I'm on the east side. Ish. I'll just drive around. We also haven't been to the lumber yard in a very long time. Lumber yard actual. Uh, my car is aggroing uh, puppets nowadays. They they, they uh, fixed it again. Yeah, they fixed this. Nice. They didn't mention it though in the uh, updates, but it would have been nice. Can I hit them now? 
No, I still... Oh, wait, I can. Wait, no, I can't. Nope, I still can't do damage to him. Damn it. How am I supposed to kill all these guys that I'm damaged that I'm uh, attracting right now? But yeah, I'm gonna have to. Before I used to be able to at least uh, get some kind of momentum going and hit some of them, but now it's not. It's not doing any momentum work at all. I'm gonna have to use my pistol. I'm not probably possibly attract more. I gotta reload my my uh, magazines now too. Oh, it did damage that uh, creepy taco. My uh, my car health went down a little bit there. Yep, it went down again. It's 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 kind of glitchy. I kind of wish the uh, windshield would uh, spider web a little bit. I love the way the reload animation is working. It's it's super realistic. <laughs> I like how it just like flies up there. I'm afraid to get out. just a slither. I'm still like over 90% probably. I feel like it only damaged it if I shoot through the front windshield. But from the uh, left side, it didn't uh, damage. Let me see. Try. Yeah, that didn't damage here from the, win to the left window. But from the windshield, it does, though. For some reason. Also, Creepy Tucker, if you want to get that car later, let me know. Just, uh, just let me know. I can shovel you over. Hopefully you don't have too much damage. The inventory goes red when your gear is damaged. Oh, that's true. Yeah. Yeah, like I said, it's... Probably like 90%. Let me look. It's eight, it's 88% right now. Ooh, that's a lot. That's a lot of damage. Shit. Yeah, that's a lot of damage, actually. That's alright. I'll fix it up. Got a vehicle repair kit in my car. You're right. I totally forgot about that part. 
forgot. Good call. Ooh, I don't have a big car uh, repair kit though. Oh, I don't have a jack. Wait, can I? Oh, I could. Oh, I could repair it without, um... I could repair it without a car jack. At the bottom here, it said repair like a chassis. And it didn't use up much. I had 10 out of 20, now I have 8 out of 20. And it was at 88%. That didn't use up much. Can you repair the jack? Mm -hmm. Yeah, that was the first time I repaired it, actually. You can actually do a lot without the jack? Nice. Well, that's good. Actually, you know what? Come back out. Come back out, bro. I need to drink water. Uh, I think I'm gonna go back to base actually. I have a lot of stuff in my car. I can't really loot very well. What is that? Is that a balloon or something? What is that? Oh, that's a crane thing. Okay, never mind. I, I think I just need to go back to base. I think that's just too much crap. Like, I gotta empty out my stuff. Hey, baby. You want a treat? You want treaties? You want a treaty B? Another one, Mopey. Hey, Owie, what's up, Owie? Here we go. What's up, Owie? How's it going? What's up, Owie? What are you doing? Chilling. You get your coffee yet? Chilling, chilling. No coffee yet. What? Just finished and did. Mm. What'd you have? Something good? Hopefully. Yeah, food. Nice. <laughs> Perfect. 
Our dishwasher is finally working. The repair guys came today unexpectedly. I thought they weren't going to come till like at least next week or something, the part. But uh, they got here early, so thank God. I told them, I was like, yo, I, you guys came earlier than I expected. And he was like, yeah, the, the, the part didn't take very long to come, so perfect. Excellent. Excellente. Excellent. Ooh, another car. Oh, wait, that's the same car I've seen that come before. But uh, yeah, pretty happy that uh, our dishwasher works again. Hopefully it won't leak. Uh, they tested it. But uh, hopefully when you, we actually go to use it, it won't uh, it won't uh, leak again. I'm gonna go check out the gas station. That's up here on the way home. Lofi, here's her food being made, I think. No puppets. They must have despawned when I, after I drove by earlier. Nice. She hears it. She sends super attention. See if you can see her. There she is. There she is, Lofi. She's like listening. <laughs> to downstairs, the cam's opening or whatever. You gotta wait for your food down there, little pea. Not here. Oh no, I'm too far away. Candy Bob. Uh, cherry seed bag. I'll take that. I need this whole can of nasty green peas. So to celebrate our dishwasher working earlier, we got Chick-fil-A. So then we didn't really have to actually use our <laughs> dishwasher. Good times, good times.
All right, let's go get rid of all the stuff that we have in our car. Let's ram it up here. Gotta get used to where all this uh, stuff is now, all the storage units. Car stuff. Milk. Lots of milk. Ugh, those milks are deteriorating fast. Get rid of those. Probably gonna make someone sick. We need a shrine too for a little pee. Oh boy. Okay. Got a lot of stuff to build still though. Doesn't help that we can't build a uh a ladder to go up top. We have to build like we can't just put a flat ladder, a vertical flat ladder. On the outside of the building like we used to be able to so we have to build like uh like like an actual one right now like a staircase mm -hmm. yeah so i have to build like an actual staircase Ugh. Maybe I'd chop this uh, corner here, go up, go up top or something. I don't know. I haven't decided yet. Hmm. Up oh, mag. There we go. Cover a staircase from outside. Yeah. Yeah. Either like a like a staircase. Like I, I don't think I want to build one from inside. There's just not really any room. Like maybe this front corner here, build one here. Um I don't really know if I want to get rid of this roof here. Maybe like I just add one on the side here or something. Like build another like a little basically extend this ramp over build one block up here and go up to the top or something i don't know i haven't really decided but something like that ah uh, yeah something like that damn <laughs> can i get up here with my car maybe yeah something like that no uh yeah something like that some kind of a uh, thing to go up It'll be fine too, because it won't uh, it won't block the door. There's enough room for people to go around if you want to, for whatever reason. 
You have to do your business or whatever. All right, I'm just going to take all my stuff out. Go ahead, Lil P. Go foodies. Come on. Come on. Got a lot of medals here. Move all these metals into the right places. Ugh. No, don't put those on. Oh, we don't have another ghillie suit though. Like we don't have a like ghillie suit a top. A lot of NVGs. But I save those up. Since we turned down the loot.
Oh boy. Wow, this alternator got messed up. Yeah, see, we're, we're starting to run out of room. Oh boy. So yeah, see we're starting to run out of room here. With all the crap that we have in this already, because they take up so much space. Alright, so today I'm, I'm gonna build several car things in the garage. Car storage unit things over there. Because all these things are just huge and take up room. same color three of these are like gray and this one's green i think hard to tell by 46 grenade crap mm, sun's going down I guess hmm oh you know what I want to build uh, I want to build uh, torches up top too or something like at least a couple torches uh, to light it up it's gonna get hard to see here I do have NVGs and we do have a bunch spare, but still. Nine by thirty nine. Five, five, six, forty five. Thirty odd six, etc. That should work, right? <laughs>
A0, Ooh, that's kind of far. Should we go to that one, A0? Oh, it's raining a lot. It's like pouring rain. Wow. Put my hat back on. Keep one of those. Sewing kit, Geiger counter. Okay. Just kind of organizing uh, my stuff. It's got a lot of shit. A lot of Geiger counters already. Okay, and pistol. All right, our first uh, gold nineteen eleven. Let's go. Magazines. Can opener. Gotta put the can openers in there, I guess. Clean my backpack in the rain. I doubt it. Oh my god, I got so much medals. Another 
Hey Gig, what's up Gig? How you been? How's it going Gig? How are ya? Car 98 suppressor. How's it going Gig? How's everything? Five four five thirty nine suppressor. Do we have one already? We do. that the m82 suppressor god damn we got that one doing all right thanks for asking doing all right I need to collect 600 plus metal scraps to complete the final upgrades to my metals well perfect i don't have 600 plus metal scraps for baby taco but uh i'm still dropping some off i still got a bunch in my car that i'm gonna drop off Tonight will be exciting. My son is a freshman in high school. He's actually starting at, uh, what is that, left wing for his, high, uh, for his school soccer team. He's good. It's supposed to be 37. Dad's going to freeze in his stance. Dude, you need a butt warmer. You need a butt warmer. Or like uh, hand warmers and feet warmers or something. You need something. Actually, on Sunday. So Sunday was the start of uh, Chinese New Year slash Lunar New Year. And uh, yeah, I was outside for a good hour, hour and a half and it was like 32, 35 degrees. And uh, it was kind of drizzly, kind of sleety. And uh, it was cold. My, f my feet, my toes and my hands were like pretty numb. Maybe whiskey in my coffee. Hey, whatever floats your boat gig. Whatever you're into, I guess. <laughs> if that's what you're into. Mm, we, we don't have any wires. Oh. Interesting. Is wires metal? Yeah. Okay. Metal. Five, five, six, four, five. Forty-five, 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 five, five, six, four, five. Forty-five, forty-five, forty-five. A decent amount of forty-fives. Let's go. Fifty seven, forty four, forty five. What's in this one again? Three oh eight, three thirty eight. Where is I? Three oh eight, three thirty eight. Shit, no room. Okay, that'll go. 30 out 6, 308, 338. I don't like that formatting. I hate it. I hate that formatting. Doesn't look good. Their stadium complex is on a hill. I've never been out there where it's not 15, 10 to 15 miles per hour winds. Texas weather is fun sometimes. Ew. That sounds freezing. Hope you have like a balaclava or whatever. Cover your face. How scum looks interesting. I've been messing with the division. It's awesome. Inventory management can be mind confusing. 
Oh, the inventory. Oh, yeah. In in division. Yeah. I don't I don't bother with that in the division to be honest. Uh, there are people that like like to hyper optimize in that game. I'm just not into it. I've never been hyper into the being super efficient in the division. This game though is a little different. This game's a little slower pace for me. Well, it's just different. Thanks like though for the dab, baby. <sighs> this game is a bit more slower paced. I've been playing it for like a couple years now. Uh, it's fun. It's not your standard, you know, kind of shooter game. Not your standard shooter game. It's very realistic in that you have to you have to take care of your your guy in terms of food, drinking, peeing, pooping. You could get uh, infections from getting attacked by puppets who are like kind of like dirty, basically. So you can get infections there. They've just recently added modular cars, modular base building. There's a nuclear power plant now that you can get radiation from. There's a lot of stuff going on in this game. Ghost Recon Wildlands seems slower paced than Division. Oh, yeah, absolutely. I think a Ghost Recon Breakpoint is also on sale right now, too which we used to stream as well. Long time ago. As usual, our M9 magazine collection is very, very good. Getting to be very good. So we got our nine millimeters here, nine millimeters here. I'm just gonna keep all the nine millimeters in the same area. Ghost Recon Wildlands and PS5 80% off is fun. Nice. I, I used to play it. Uh, I've played it before. I didn't really play much of it though. The group I was playing with, it, they were just way too slow paced for me and I was just not into it. I was like falling asleep playing with them. So I didn't play that, but I played a lot of Division 2, of course. And uh, I played that by myself. So I could move at my own pace, which was way fast her than when I played Wildlands. So it's much much more enjoyable for my pace.
All right, I'm gonna have to build something. It's getting hard to see here. Um. All right, oh, let's get a ramp. Let's see, how can we do this? Let me put a ramp here. Hmm. I want to put a ramp right here next to the other one, but it I don't it won't let me uh snap to it for some reason. I don't know why. Maybe because the foundation like just because the ground is all slanted and weird. So maybe oh I can only do it on a foundation I guess let me build the foundation first probably Like this, I guess. Hey, baby. Hey, P. What's up, baby? You need some of your food? Rope inside. A lot of rope inside. Good. It looks super ugly at the front there. I'm gonna put it in the back. I think I'm gonna put it in the back. It looks super ugly back, like in the front. And I lost my sticks. Where'd the sticks go? Oh, there they are. Yeah, that looks super ugly. Okay, stand by. Ugh.
Okay. See so if we can put a little ramp here. What? Unable to place, not touching ground. I mean, not touching the ground. What's not touching the ground? I don't get this. I guess because it's slopes. Can't put it there either. Put one here, I should be able to do it though. What? I don't understand what's not touching the ground. This is why I'm not the one that builds these for us. I guess theoretically we could go like that, but it's kind of stupid. And then I could build a stairs up there. But it looks really stupid though. I wonder how he did this. Hey Sasquatch, how are you, man? Yeah, it's been a while. How are you? How's everything going? Hope everything's going all right with you. 
don't understand this. Oh, I can only do one here. I can't even do one like this. It looks stupid though. Go like this. Yes, go like that. Bam, bam. Had some ups and downs. Well, I'm sorry I hear about the uh, the downs, but I'm glad uh, you got some ups in there though. That's always good. Good thing. Not all all downs. But, uh, I'm happy to see Well, we got this going. How ugly is this right now? <laughs> what? Okay, this is not... Nope. We need, like, this one? This one. Overlapping? What? Okay, there we go. There we go. This is ugly. Creek's gonna see this later. He's gonna be like, what's this janky shit we got going? Uh, first month I was dealing with the physical therapy and how the vertigo hit me. I got better and is it isn't hitting me that hard hey high five on that though i i haven't dealt with the, the vertigo stuff but um i've been through pt for like physical injuries and it's just it's tough especially having to do with them, them uh like at home like actually going there was the easiest part like doing it there with someone was uh, a lot easier than having like doing it myself at home I'm glad you got better though, so you know some of it's working, right? We got brake oil too, so as soon as I get these this built, I can put a couple of uh, torches up top, and then we can light up the uh, the building inside. Ooh, hurt my leg and it was swollen for about six weeks. Oh my god! Like, did you like did you wear a brace, a boot? Did you have to use a knee scooter, like crutches? Crutches is the worst. I hope you did not have to use crutches. Crutches is so bad. Crutches in the boot suck. So bad.
All right, we got this. Can I put a wall here? A wall here so it'll fall off. Priest gonna hate this addition. <laughs> He's gonna cry when he sees this. Like, what is this abomination? See, if I put another wall back here, then you won't fall off. Like, yeah, like this. So we won't fall off. How's that? How's that look? Should I put some windows in these? Let's do some window ones, window walls. My ankle and knee were sprained, no boot, because none would fit, but I did need crutches. Ooh, crutches is the worst. Actually, you know what? I take that back. Crutches isn't the worst. The worst is the boot, because you're uneven. I don't know if any of you guys uh, have used the boot before, but it sucks. I, I, I had to use it twice, because when I bro broke my uh, one of the metatarsals on my right foot, I used it there. And then when I sprained my ankle, I also use that too and after all of this I realized and I found out that there is something that you can strap around your other shoe like your normal shoe to match the height of your boot I had no idea so like both incidents I, I walked around for like you know weeks and such like crooked so like my back would hurt and like my hips hurt just everything was just like lopsided and that was so bad the crutches at least like you move together so it's not as bad but uh i think if i ever had to do it again i don't know like i, I would definitely buy the uh, thing that straps to your shoes i've seen stuff like this like the the knee scooter but yeah, that, that wouldn't work out for you, Sasquatch, I think, just because of how the knee scooter works, the, like where it puts pressure. Went to Mexico to see my grandparents, got my leg checked out, and turns out it was twisted to the right a little. Is that after the healing? Is that after it healed? After the month, yeah. Oh, okay, I see. Yeah, that sucks. It's a little too late now, though. Like after after it started healing, though, to do anything about it. I mean, I think the best they could do is like, if you didn't fracture it, though. If you didn't fracture anything, then there's nothing really they can do about it. I think if if it's something fractured, they could refracture it again to reset it, so that hopefully it, it you know heals better but I think if it's something like that uh 
You just have to deal with it, I guess. I need a lot of sticks. So they had to pull it. It was the muscles and tendons, but no broken bones. Sometimes that's the worst though, the muscles and tendons. Like those are like the harder ones to uh to get right. The soft tissue stuff. I don't know. I'm no expert, but uh I've had some some is some issues myself. My hamstring I tore uh, I tore two I tore almost all three heads on my hamstring. But that actually, that actually healed very well. It healed really well, except for sometimes when it's like bad weather. I get sort of like the quote old person thing where I can tell the weather's weather's bad <laughs> weather's coming but uh other than that it's okay like sometimes when I uh, I need to warm up a little more and uh it's back to where it should be my leg pops and lose my balance so I I lose my balance sometimes too actually Sasquatch but I I'm not sure if I lose balance because of my hamstring or because of my 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 metatarsal and my ankle that got weak after they got injured so sometimes when i'm going up the stairs if i'm not careful i like kind of fall over like lose my balance like i'll catch myself i haven't actually fallen over yet and actually injured myself like that but uh, a lot of times i'll lose my balance especially on the stairs because you know you're on one foot as you step up or down i actually don't have problems stepping down uh because momentum will gra gravity will we'll pull me down put my other foot down but going up the stairs though sometimes i kind of fall backwards so i have to be real careful there i use like the hand railings like an old person <laughs> fell yesterday in the shower oh god not good in the shower not good not good at all not good news did you uh did you hurt yourself there or no hopefully not hopefully nothing too bad Sometimes I feel like when I'm just standing around, if I just kind of like just kind of sway sideways, like I just lose my balance sometimes. But uh, I mean, it's been five years since I tore my hamstring, but the uh, the ankle and the metatarsal stuff hasn't been too long. I guess a couple years now. I did one after another, like got one healed and then got the other. So they kind of like a back to back. But, uh, they still really suck. I 
if I should put it in the back. Put this in the back. The uh, stairs here. Maybe Krieg would hate it more. Hate it less. It actually is really ugly. Is that really ugly? Luckily, I landed on my my gluteus maximus and bumped my head. Oh my god, you bumped your head too, dude. Not good. No, that's not lucky. Not lucky at all. Not that's not good at all. Being big and tall saved you. Cushioning. Be our watchtower actually right here. Could have landed on my leg and shattered it. Well, that could be bad too, but that's better than uh, permanently damaging your your head though. concussion I think oh my god I don't know how you can tell if you have a concussion or not so I wouldn't be the best person to ask about that but if you think you do though probably gonna get that checked out pause <laughs> Throw pause dude that was so funny you know yesterday the uh st streamer gets ready to box cat or whatever <laughs> whatever the title was that was hilarious i showed it to dt he laughed he said it was pretty good too so good job high five one log two logs Hit it after he fell so the force wasn't a lot. Oh, well, that's good. That's better. That's better. That's better here. I fell on my butt once and it, it hurt so bad. It was like, uh, I was like shoveling snow outside on the street, like digging my car out basically. And uh, I took one step back and I didn't realize that gigantic block of ice was right behind me. So I tripped on it and like fell backwards on my butt and like my hip, and my back. And uh, my my watch, my Apple watch was like, are you OK? Because <laughs> so I got the fall detection on because, you know, I go running, I go like biking and stuff. So like all sorts of things can happen to me while I'm out there by myself. But that was the first time that my watch did that. It actually works. I was, uh, I was impressed with it. Impressed. It's 
Need more logs of these things. She's giving me the butt. Little P's giving me the butt. Oh, that hurts me. You end up feeling stiff for a few days. I know I will. Yeah, it wasn't too bad, but uh, yeah, like my butt, definitely my hip area was definitely a little, a little sore the next couple days. Luckily, I'm not that tall and not that big. So when I fell, it wasn't too high off the ground, luckily. <laughs> Tell you are the longer it takes to hit the ground. It's true, very true. And the harder you hit it, you hit it. And we're back. Okay, got this built. Perfect, excellent. And I'm gonna put a couple of, I wanna put some um, torches up. Put some torches up. That way we can see inside. Creek's gonna hate it, but we don't have to light it though, if he doesn't like him. Advanced torch stand. Should people thought a tree had the house the first time I fell? Oh my god. Regular torch. Oh, where is this? I hate finding these things. Looking for them so hard. There we go. I think the easiest thing is to put them on these corners here. Like that. All right, bring my sticks back. Hi, baby. Hi, baby. Hi, baby. What's up? I can use these uh shorter sticks. Oh no, these long wooden stick crap.
priest gonna hate this. I just know it. Thank you, Sasquatch. Been, s been slacking. Ooh, it's kind of uneven. Got OCD. Hmm. How dare Krieg build an uneven? Two uneven buildings for me. Uh, one, two, three, four. Use all my sticks already. I'm gonna use my uh, my theraband for you, Sasquatch. This thing helps me with um like golfer's elbow and like tendonitis and stuff like that. Basically, just do some twists with it, and my wrist will crack, and it'll kind of stretch all my elbows and stuff like that too. basically do like uh wrist curls and reversed wrist curls for it kind of crazy just like rotating it like this i can feel all like the tendons in my wrist like move around yeah, this, this thing's actually great. It's really great, Sasquatch. It comes in different uh, sizes. This is the lightest one, and they come, like, thicker. Like, it's it's the lightest one, and aka also the, like, smallest in circumference. They have some that's, like, a green color one, uh, I think a red color one. But this, the yellow one is the uh, lightest one that they have. And you can do something like this, too. You can, like, twist it like this, and that'll give it... You can twist it like this, it'll give it tension, so you can release, and then, uh it'll like pull your wrist and there's other ones like this just, de just depending on how, how, how you hold it uh, depending on how you hold it and which way it goes it'll do different things on your wrist but this is the uh, TheraBand flex bar TheraBand flex bar Not sponsored. Wish I was. <laughs> I think I inhaled a lot of cat hair or something. I'm feeling like sniffly. My, my nose is kind of runny. Sounds good, Sasquatch. Yeah, if, if you end up getting it, let me know how you like it. I always like uh, sharing like uh, stuff like that with people and you know, just kind of overall, overall interested in stuff like that. So let me know. I'm 
All right, we do have some brake oil. I kind of feel bad if I use them all though. I got some craftables. more because it's still kind of dark inside but now at least we can kind of see inside now but yeah i want to add add more torches got to so let's see what ye say eight okay so there's eight of eight squares i guess grid squares so if i do one here we're gonna do a couple more like in the like one more one more line in the middle here uh one two three and put one along the line here put one on the outside there and one in the middle here that should light up everything really well then He's gonna love this. I have this. I have the exact same setup on my uh, on my cabin. Yeah, when I learned you, you can light up stuff underneath, it was the best thing. It was the best thing. strategy resource friendly uh do you have to look for the oil or tell it's not friendly at all <laughs> it's not friendly at all uh yeah i would have to keep replenishing it but since it's a advanced uh torch it will last quite a bit like yeah 20 20 minutes or so something like that um but i can replenish it with other things it's just that the brake oil um is the best thing to use you can use vegetable oil you could use rope you could use rags a rope like a you can use sticks even which you can find in uh, bushes you can cut down bushes and do it there but those aren't um they don't last long they don't last long They don't really last long. So I like using the brake oil. But uh, here, let's see. Like here, you could use brake oil, you could use vesper oil to make it. But uh, you can fuel it with a bunch of stuff. Let's see, look here. You can fuel it with rags, 
aseptic rags cash tree bark rope small wooden stick break oil long wooden stick small wooden stick long wooden stick you can fill it with a bunch of stuff but um the break oil and the vegetable oil is just the best But no, I wouldn't keep this going all the time. I'm just keeping them up so that I could see inside. And I probably wouldn't light them up all the time. Maybe just a couple at a time. I wouldn't light up all of them. Right now, I'm just, I'm just doing it. I'm just doing it so I don't have to use my night visions the whole time. Because I can't, because I'm going to use it all. I'm going to have to recharge my night visions. I like how little P just sits and looks at you at any moment when murder mittens could end you. No, she wouldn't end me. I'm, I'm the one that gives her food now. I keep telling you this. She would not. She would not. She would not do that. Hello, Krieg. How are you, Krieg? Krieg, I'm sorry if I'm ruining your building, but I'm doing I'm doing something here. You can you can disapprove if you would like. But uh, I added the side things because we need a shrine. We need a little pea shrine. We need a little pea shrine uh, to throw away our junk. And I didn't want to build something from the inside because there's just no room. There's no room inside. So I threw something out on the outside there. I don't think it looks pretty ugly, but it gets me up to the roof. And that's really all I care about. I add a little wall there so you don't fall off the, the stairs. And I'm adding... Uh, torches so we can kind of light up the inside a little bit because it's really big but it's also really dark in there but at least now we can see something so feel free to veto and or let me know if you want me to change something or delete everything i just spent the last two hours doing that's also acceptable and like i mentioned we don't have to light all these torches all the time i'm just putting these up here so that just looks quite good Phew. Thank you, Krieg. Oh, also, I was trying really hard to put those ramps, like the exact ramps you have here. I was trying to put those ramps on this, but it wouldn't let me. So I had to use the stairs instead. It said it wouldn't, it wasn't like touching the ground. Unable to touch the ground or something. So I had to use this uh, stairs. I also wasn't sure if you wanted it in, on the side or on the back, but I don't know. I did what I did, so. Hopefully that's acceptable. Hey, little P. Okay, little P. I'll give you a treat. I'll give you a treat. I'll give you a treat. How's coffee today, Creek? How's everything? How's the boss? Yeah, that's one thing I found out that the ramp is a fixed length. It is a pain. Yeah, I noticed you couldn't change like how high the ramp is. And I also uh, couldn't put the ramp, like I built it a couple times. I couldn't build a, the ramp here either. Like I moved the foundation up further and I tried the ramp here and the ramp looked like it was touching the ground, but then it, it just didn't work. So I had to use these. Don't worry, Krieg. We're going to light this place up. We're going to light this place up. It's going to be so bright. We'll see everything. We'll be able to see everything. We will see every little thing inside. 
No, not that. No. Just need one more stick, lol. I'll do. Let's go. Let's see how bright it is inside. Copy good. Boss is still asleep. Nice. Very nice. I'm also going to build a couple more. Um. Storage things in the garage, the garage, as you would call it, for the uh, car stuff. The car, the car unit one is all almost already full. Already. So all of them are lit up to what it looks like. Not too bright. We can see everything inside. Let's go. Nice. We can see every single thing inside. Perfect. Of course you have to go up and light them first, but there's that. again i have no idea krieg <laughs> i have no idea what i said i'm gonna be honest i have no idea what i said <laughs> uh as far as i know when i claim a cabin that should leave uh two free sounds good i think one of them i don't know if adam i don't know if adam claimed one dt has not claimed one i don't think tubby has either so i don't know what that means i have no idea uh, cars. Oh, the storage units. Yeah, so the storage units. I'm gonna build some over there in the in the garage, the garage. This one's already almost full. See, look, it's almost full because all the things take up so much room. Uh, so I'm gonna I'm gonna start putting in storage units on this side now. I want to put some stuff here. I don't know how I'll design this part, but we'll see. Creepy Taco said he was almost interested in making double doors for this so that he could drive the car in there uh, to resupply or whatever. Which I think is would be kind of cool because you got a ramp anyway and we can pull the car in and then uh, maybe I'll make the big cabinets a lot just along the edge of the space and then you can pull your car in maybe. So maybe we could do that. I kind of, I kind of was interested in that idea. Yeah, so basically maybe change it to double doors wide enough for a car to fit inside. I don't know how you need to change this, but uh, I don't want to destroy anything yet. But uh, yeah, maybe just enough space to pull in a car. Uh, can you use this one? I don't know if you can use this one. It won't let me snap anything to see, but I don't know. Did you have to put a door frame maybe? Did you have to put a door frame? I have no idea. I don't even know. But yeah, maybe something like that. And like I said, I'll probably build those big uh, storage units. These big ones, I'll just put them all around. All the way, all the way around. Door frame first. Oh, okay, yeah. 
Yeah, so I'll just I'll just build it all the way around the edges here like this. So one, two, like three, well, uh, one maybe three or two here, and then three more. So we'll have plenty of space there. Maybe even pull two cars in, even if we wanted to. I do like this roof though, Creek. That that's nice. I like that little roof there. That's pretty sweet. All right, I want to start continue uh, unloading all this stuff that we have. Got your water too. The life of the builder. <laughs> the veranda? Yeah, that. Whoa, creepy taco. Speak of which. We can make a new thing. Oh, we could put one of these as lighting. Like once we move the uh, car stuff and the gardening to the other side, I can make one of these uh, storage units to be lighting. Like uh, lanterns and stuff, whatever, maybe. Like these, uh, uh, wherever they are, lights. No, where the hell? Uh, these gas lantern stuff. And the portable work light and put those in its own uh, thing because those are really big too. At creepy. Do you like how lit we are right now? <laughs> it's so bright. Let's go. Yeah. Okay. All right. Ooh, he's peeing on me, bro. Is it leaking through? No leaks. We're good. I can see where I'm peeing. Perfect. <laughs> nice. Today, Creek, I got seven broccolis from our garden. We got seven broccolis from the garden. Somehow. Shockingly. antibiotics here
please. I gotta build a uh, barbecue too somewhere as well. Hey, a bobby. Sorry, I haven't got to the middle part. No problem, Creek. No rush, no rush. No rush, whenever you... Just whenever. Whenever you get to it. All good. Got a lot of uh, ump magazines, but no ump. No ump still. No ump still. No ump still. I went to one cargo drop earlier and I got those ump magazines. Uh, but nothing else though. Like I got some 45 ammo, but that's it. question so if i go upstairs and put out those fires right now that we're using those break oils does that like waste the break oil that's there or will that just save the rest of the break oil for later should i go put those out and just let them run what do you think custard what's up custard how's it going custard Like getting peanut butter but no jelly or bread <laughs> sometimes that's just all you need though the good stuff nothing much got a high fever at the moment ouch you sick you sick custard you're not working though right are you just at home chilling resting hopefully just stretching just doing old people things good good but uh, not much but the same really same old same old you know has pumpkins in here. Ugh. I want to throw these pumpkins out. They're pretty gross. Is uh is butter considered snack? 
Yeah, right? You put butter or snack, right? <laughs> <laughs> Rip the seeds out of it. Yeah, good, 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 good call. Good call, Krieg. Good call. Good call. Good call. This whole seed container is a mess. Absolute mess here. 79257. 79257. Flares. Traditionally, we get a lot of M9 magazines as well as uh, 1911 magazines, but not yet though. We don't have a lot of uh, 1911 magazines. We get a lot of uh, M9s though. Yeah, custard. Yes, yes. If you play single player, no one plays with you, and like no one, like you, you don't play with anyone, and you can't play with anyone else. Uh, it's just offline. It's just you, you and the puppets. Uh, you, you, you can change settings, like I do on my server settings, but you have to go into the ini file and change the configurations there yourself. But it is doable, and I know Bob does it. But with uh, s online servers, though, you can change them through an interface, but it costs money to rent a server. Of course. It looks like Rust and Escape from Tarkov made a baby. I mean, maybe. Something like that. Something like that. Uh, Creek. So do you think I should, um... Do you think I should put out these fires? Save the brake fuel? Or would that just waste it anyway? Should I just leave it alone? Should I just leave them? Or will it waste? What do you think? Damn, that's, that's slick, Creepy Taco. <laughs> that's some slick drifting right there. It shouldn't waste it. All right, let's uh, let's put it out. Cause now that it's daytime, well, we don't need all these uh, fires. I don't think it should either. But no one knows. No one knows. Of course, with having so many torches, now I have to go through everyone and put them all out. <laughs> I have to put every single goddamn one out. Uh, but yeah, up here we're gonna make a uh, shrine for little P, aka all your trash and dis items you wanna discard, put them on the table so our base isn't littered with trash everywhere like it is right now. So that's what the shrine is for, but I haven't built it yet, of course. I'll build it very soon. I'll build in that back corner so we don't have to go too far. Oh, should we build a little outhouse for Creepy Taco? So I don't have a pee everywhere on the roof. Pee and poop everywhere. Oh, it's too bad. You, can, you can't build a toilet, huh? A, uh, a thunder box. Can't build a thunder box. Scum looks a lot like a, a lot of fun, but a huge learning curve. Yes, there is a big learning curve, Custard, but 
we have people here that have been pay playing for years now custard so and i think you're on a discord right so yes you are on a discord so feel free to you know, ask questions here there etc everywhere but we will be all more than happy to to help if you want it some people don't want the help though so up to you how you want to play it do it do it all help is great yeah yeah like we have a scum channel in our discord and uh post you know questions there people will answer i'll answer as much as i could can oh my god my dude's thirsty as hell what is creepy taco doing over there oh he's building a roof fancy he's gonna build a little roof here huh yeah he is a fancy You might, you might, you might, yeah, you might. So there is a tutorial custard but it sucks it's the worst it's the worst tutorial ever like like some people like to play this game without hand holding and, and no tips at all but like i said if, if you need help or anything like feel free to ask us i'm here to help if you want it we are here to help if you want it all right that should give me some some hydrations in my body Not unloading all this crap i have in my uh chest i got just way too much stuff i have like all this like metal here wait got a bunch of metal here maybe i could just give it to creepy taco actually i'm gonna have to move it anyway somewhere he's gonna get it from somewhere so <laughs> you better start start the me Ellen the hard way yeah luckily I, I had Creek to help me when I first started the game and uh, so I got some tips from him I didn't want to be super handheld but uh, like some things I found out on my own the hard way as well but uh Krieg was there for me but uh, I like to be there for people to help too if uh, if they want it so in case some people play you know pl play the game uh, differently so some people like to not have to figure out anything on their own some people like to figure out everything on their own
Did you play Uber for uh, Stacking for the Cars? No, I did not. I told him that if he needs a ride to let me know, he has not let me know, so. Nope. The one he said it is still out there somewhere. I forget where. I do wish Okay. All right, we'll get that car. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I put my stuff back. I have no idea where we're going. Where we're going. Ready for adventuring with creepy taco. Okay, do. What if I run him over? What do you think happens? Like push him? We might glitch. We might both disappear <laughs> off the earth. <laughs> this is creepy taco's junkyard. Welcome to Creepy Doggo's Junkyard. All right, where the hell is the other place that he wanted to go? Let me check out Discord here. Second car needs a battery or a fourth wheel to be moved. Picked up one of the car, two cars near the naval base. Okay, so they're both down the naval base somewhere, I guess. Wait, meat pancakes? Who's making meat pancakes? Um. Oh. <laughs> Running over him. Got it. Gotcha. Sorry, there's like a delay. Um, not because I put a delay, but there's like a little bit of delay. And I have short-term memory loss, so to the mold. So, Krieg knows, so he, he he'll he'll do a really good job of reminding me of what we're talking about. Else, I just have no idea what I'm talking about anymore. Order of P two and five. Okay. All right. Left. 
This little car is so great off-road. Dude, I can't eat or drink well in the car. I'm hungry. I agree. Oh shit, wrong way. I agree. I also wish I could drink and drive. Oh crap, I'm going the wrong way. I'm going the wrong way. That's right, we're gonna off road. <laughs> no, we're not lost. We're not lost. We're not lost. Why would you ask that? How dare you? Southeast. Oh my god, wrong way, bro. <laughs> We're not lost. We're fine. We'll get there. We'll get there, Kuka Taco. Relax. Chill, chill. Wow, right, Fang is left here somewhere. On our way. We're on an adventure, no no such thing as lost. High five. High five Sasquatch, that's right, baby. Might just get turned around a few times. But we are never lost. We're never lost. We are never lost. Oh boy, wrong way. So I've noticed that we attract uh, puppets now with uh, the car now. That was not uh, like that before. Oh shit, the other way. with the new update but now it's back again so we can uh we can aggro the puppets again but we can't still can't run them over though 95 percent positive the cars were oh the, no the, the car the car will be fine we're fine good thing there aren't any rivers this way very true absolutely 100 percent yep yep 100 percent We'd have already uh, drowned by now if there were any rivers this way. So that's one car you got here, I think. Think I'm getting car sick? No. Only water destroys cars. Yeah, C Creepy Taco would know. This one? If you shoot out the side of your window as opposed to the, the front, it won't damage your, your vehicle. I 
think it's safe. Love the tracer rounds? Yes. No biggie. Can't fix while you're in it. Ooh. Makes sense though, while the car's uh, turned on. Ah! Oh, then she build a platform with the spare car. Sounds good. Sounds good. Thank you. push it downhill yeah I was gonna say whoa it's not uphill it's not facing uphill so a little hint for uh custard custard you're still there and uh still getting this game if you park your car downhill or find a car that's facing downhill you can still pretty much just start the car even the batteries you, 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 uh, even if the battery's weak oh god like it's still this oh should have brought a wheel should have brought a wheel for him Show our wheel. Yeah, if you if you park downhill or find a car downhill, you, you can still start the car. Even if the battery is a uh, low battery or no battery. Well, I don't know about if it, the actual battery doesn't exist, but three wheel and baby. chance he's got no chance he only has three wheels <laughs> see ya what it want to be ya baby figure out which way we're going i don't know my way around here uh straight through till morning <laughs> that was funny Your boy's got to pee.
He's coming. He's gonna beat me. I have to pee. He's gonna beat us after all back to base. That's right, we'll pass him. We got this. We got this. Oh, he's shortcutting it though. Sorry, right, we got this one straight away. Took a pee break and everything. We should have taken. We should have eaten a snack. Did you? All right, back to getting all the shit out of my car. What's up, Bob? No, I was uh, just got back from shuttling uh, Creepy Taco to grab his uh, grab his uh, three wheeled car at the naval base area. Dropped him off. We killed we killed uh, puppets down there. Dropped him off, and then uh, I cut him off coming home. <laughs> and then uh, at the top of the hill, there I had to pee, so I got on top of my car and peed. He passed me, but then I passed it again. So. He had no chance with three wheels. No chance. You got it. How you doing, Bob? What's up, Subby? Did you break it again? What? I didn't break anything. My car's fine. How dare you? How dare you? My car's 100% fine. So it turns out, Bob, and Tubby, I don't know if you guys saw in the Discord, but uh, it turns out we had the loot modifier in Creek. We had the loot modifier set at 10 on the server settings for some reason. Whoa. Look at my crates. And uh, it was set. It was set at ten. Uh, so I changed it to five. I haven't really looted that much today, so I don't know. Well, I probably have to change it though. Like I, th I thought originally it was set at three, which I'm pretty sure it was at some point. But maybe one of the updates messed up the G portal settings and changed it to ten. That explains why yesterday or the Tuesday, I was getting so much crap, getting so much loot. Just busy shoveling driveway. Eek. How much snow are you getting, Bob? Day's going all right. Thanks for asking. Bob has a cabin, Krieg. Yes, three wheels is better than four wheels. No, 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 it's not. Three wheels, but not better than four wheels. But yeah, B B uh, Bob has a cabin. I have a cabin. Kirby Taco has a cabin. Everyone else, no cabin. As far as I can tell. As far as I know. 
Tubby may as well just kick Tubby off the server. He's not playing with us anymore. No, just kidding. Kidding, 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 kidding. Uh, okay. Kidding. Bob, I put uh, I put uh, advanced torches on top of this <clears throat> these buildings here. So then at nighttime, if you need to light them up, you can so you can see stuff. If you want to, you don't have to see stuff if you don't want to. But we had nighttime earlier, so I was like, nah, bro, I didn't do this. Not like this. Not like this. It's too difficult to find these magazines where they belong. Which one's this one? The AK-15. We don't have an AK-15 one. Isn't this one at the top? No, it's not. And I want to build, I need to build a uh, little piece shrine at the top too. No enemies. No, I had them, but I didn't want to waste them. I didn't want to use use up use it up all up for no reason. Plus, it looks cool. I built a I built a side thing here too. Check it out. I got the Krieg approval, the builder approval. I built a side thing here so we can get up to the top. And I'm gonna build like a little table here, I guess. Probably just a table back here. Not too far away from this, so you can probably build it here. No, something like this. Just put it here. Put it here. I don't know, somewhere. Put it somewhere. That way we can get to the roof. I, I, I kind of hate that <clears throat> we can't build a, a vertical ladder. That sucks. We do not need more magazines, Toby. Yesterday I found like six pairs of NVGs. Not sure maybe about a foot of snow since last night and this morning. Eek. Uh, oh, well, I don't, I don't have any snow news, but my good news is the dishwasher is working again. The repair people came today, this morning. And uh, they got that fixed. Yippee! Can we build a horizontal ladder? Well, Tubby, you can't build anything, so... You, you, you have to be in the game to build anything. So... Nope. Creep Attack already christens this. Chris, christened? Chris, Chris, christened this? Chris, Chris, Christian? He already peed up here. While I was underneath. And I told him there's no leaks. So we're good. I'm at the stupid office, otherwise I'll like, ugh. I thought you were sick. Pretty sure you got sick yesterday, so you should, should definitely be at home today. No community thunderbox. So I kind of thought of building a, a, uh, a thing up there. A thunderbox a uh really small four walled well three wall with one door thing that we can use up there you can build like stalls for bathrooms up there <laughs> the only leaks are the ones creepy taco is taking on the roof <laughs> hey sweeney todd what's up sweeney todd how are you doing how are you how are you it's been it was like really rainy here. It's like huge storm. Oh, I better get my rain jacket on. Where's my rain jacket? 
There it is. Got a hat on too. Wrong hat though. Mm. Ta-da! Okay. Mm, all right. So far it's been pretty boring. Because I've just been... moving stuff around and such. trying to keep things uh not necessarily organized but uh just trying to move them out of my st all my crates and stuff my boxes i just don't have room for anything now m82 scope hunting scope let's go how was uh how was work today sweeney todd comes the rain Got RPK magazine. Pretty sure that was from the uh, airport airfield. I don't have one of these either. Why does it sound like metal? It sounds like the uh the rain is hitting metal. This is wood. Is it hitting is it just hitting my car? Kirby Sack was peeing on the roof again, he has kidney stones. Ouch. How did you do the garden to relief myself? Yo, Bob, that actually worked, Bob. I got seven broccolis from one plant earlier. Have I ever been raided by Twitch? Like Twitch, like the, the official Twitch channel gig? Yeah, seven broccoli from one plant. You must have peed really, really good, Bob, on that one plant. It's all the fruits and veggies I've been eating. Nice. It's all the vitamins, actually, they've been taking. Mm -hmm. I was streaming Division, all of a sudden I had 2,400 people watching. Nice. Yeah, we had Ubisoft uh, raid us before. Honestly, it was just a... Uh, uh, honestly, I'm gonna be super, super honest here. I uh, I don't really like the raids. Like, they're kind of exciting when they come in. But... Um, a lot of times, people that come from raids, they don't... They don't really... They don't really... Uh, stay 
follow or really care about what you're streaming depending on how the raid came it depends how the raid came if the raid came by someone that was streaming the same game you're streaming then it is more likely that those people might stay and even then if they stay it might be because they're probably just afk and they were just sitting in the channel like they're not even wa actually watching you and they just leave there's no follows and out of the people that actually do follow you from these raids i find that they don't usually come back and in interact so while it's nice that it comes it's just kind of a temporary excitement that's how i see it have a bit more faith dude i have faith i've been streaming for two years over two years now two and a half years now i have i have some faith <laughs> i have a little bit of faith i haven't given up yet i haven't given up yet really crappy mp5 magazine i'll save that for for tubby cross bro i don't know what happened to my compound bow it went somewhere i'm not real sure where it went I think it's in my cabin, actually. Super laid back and seem more realistic. You seem to play and stream second, which is awesome. There are other streamers that seem to play, but interact with the stream more, but I, but I see them and I'm like, are you going to play? I don't know that I agree with that gig. I, I've always said chats first for me. Like I'm pausing my game right now to talk to you guys. That's what I would call chat first, play second. Like obviously if I'm playing something like call of duty where we're it's a competitive game that if i stop there to talk to chat like i'm gonna die no one's gonna have a good time watching that but i i make it a point to read everybody's messages when they come in when they come through yes i might miss one or two just because it scrolls or whatever right i might miss one or two but i'll i will do 100 percent my best to try to read every single message that comes through whether or not I actually like audibly read it out loud, I'm still looking at the messages. So I don't know that I would call that I play first versus stream second. Like 100% chat is first. Like I'm here to talk to you guys. I can play games on my own, like at night by myself without talking to anybody, right? But I'm doing this so I'm so that I can interact with you guys. So interacting with you guys is 100% first before the game. So I think you got confused with that gig. Possibly. But you do play more and tell us about the game. Yes, you do ask us how we are, but personally come back because you're more personable. Oh, I try to be extremely interactive with people. Like I said, I, I'm streaming because so I can interact with you guys. If I'm just playing the game, but ignoring chat, why am I streaming then? <laughs> that doesn't make any sense. That wouldn't make any sense. 
that hundred percent would not make any sense at all. I, and uh, and and by that I mean yeah, there are people that their channels get so big that they they can't read chat, they can't talk to chat. So many things happening. I think I was saving that 1% uh, MP5 magazine for you, Tubby. And thanks for the stretches, Tubby. Let's go, baby. I'm gonna stand up for this. That's how not lazy I am. I think channels like that, it's really hard to feel like you're part of the community. And uh, for us here, I try my best to make it a place that's welcoming for everyone, to make everyone feel like, you know, we're all friends with each other. Obviously, we're not in real life, but uh, we all can come here <clears throat> and have at least something in common to talk about. And, and, and definitely feel welcome for me, at least. I can't speak for other people that are in chat. I don't control what other people say in the chat, right? But for me, I'm always here to, to welcome you here. And that, that's always been, been my goal here, to do this. We just have like, you know, we just have so, so much uh, negativity, negativity in the world. I'm, I'm trying to do my part here to spread a little bit of uh, positivity here for us. She does best to be a welcoming streamer. That's why she bakes and serves snacks on Tuesdays. Shh. That was supposed to be a secret, Tubby. How dare you? How dare you give that out? Oh, M9s now. Our first M16, I believe. Yes, sir. Let's go. Let's go. Probably tear this down, this, uh, this really shitty one down. 38%. What's a VSS? It is a factory silent sniper. Really? All right, we'll put in the sniper. Bye. New edition complete. Now do upgrade. Nice. Let's take, let's take a look at his. Uh... Oh, nice. She doesn't even pay the construction worker. Hey, I did my fair share of constructioning this time, Krieg. Thank you very much. Oh my god, creeper tackles got like brick and everything, dude. I like this. Dude, I like this. This is awesome. I like this part right here. I like that. We can all come up here on creeper tackles roof to survey the land before we head out. Now that we attract puppets with our cars when you start them up. Hundred percent, hundred percent gig. But uh, small businesses and small streaming, small, small streamers have uh, their own set of uh, I don't want to say issues, but struggles. I guess struggles. Welcome back, welcome back to the internet, creepy taco. 
All right, I guess I'll put this VSS in the snipers. Like, I don't know. I don't, I don't like it being there. Seaside, what's up, Seaside? How was your workout today, man? What were you doing today? Shoulders and abs or something? Kind of glanced at that right before stream. Or during stream, rather. boots why oh too heavy too heavy to put in my boots okay all right three three eight twenty two magazine I'm gonna keep that gold one for myself, in case you were wondering. I did drop off these two other gold ones though. So Krieg or anybody else that's interested. Got a couple of gold, gold 1911s here for you guys. did change around uh the names a little bit here so they better reflect what's inside <laughs> but they the formatting looks looks crappy though it's uh it's the best i can do gotta check the burgers what burgers sounds good seaside thanks again for, for taking me to get the car no problem creepy taco anytime Anytime. We're having... Before anybody asks, I can't believe that nobody has asked so far. Yet, but, uh... We're having chicken in a bag. For dinner. Tonight. And we're gonna use the dishwasher. Because it finally works again. We don't have to spend two hours washing the dishes. And I don't have to spend a billion times like reusing the same cutting board, obviously cleaning in between cutting things, but uh, not how to do that. Thank God. Chicken in a bag. And I got some veggies I'm gonna cook. I don't know what else though. We do, there is a Celtics game tonight. Basketball game tonight. So I'm watching that at home. 22 keep these so maybe snacks later maybe snacks later probably snacks later there's a high chance of snacks later i'm gonna be honest very high chance <laughs> extremely high chance of snackage later Seven, two, six, five, five, four. Just nine. Fifteen. 
50, 50. 50 AE, 50 AE, 50 AE, 9, 30, 9, 30, 9, 3, 57, 22. See, this is why I have to turn down the uh, loot modifier. Just get too much crap. Just too quick. We got way too much stuff. Way too fast. Too much loot. Not fair. Gonna hop off. Okie dokie. Yeah, we have fun at work. We'll miss you. Chance of snacks later 100%. You can't watch a soccer game with a snack. It's not soccer. Celtics play all three. What? Football, football, or soccer? What? <sighs> How unsubscribe from all of you. Ban chat. Welcome to Minnie's OCD channel. Craig, I was cursing your name. <laughs> I was cursing your name <laughs> earlier when I uh, did these uh, these torches earlier because I was like counting the space, trying to make them all even. And uh, you built uh, it's an uneven number of uh, like these squares of things. So I had to figure out how to spread it out so that it looked even. So I was cursing your name, but not, not too loudly, though. Apparently some of the Chinese community were upset by some of the items I added. Some of the hats. The rice paddy hats. Straw hats. What do you mean you added? Yes, Tubby. Uh, and yeah, I, I mean that DT does not have to spend two and a half hours doing dishes. Correct. I mean, next week I would be because, well, you know, that's, uh, yes, that's exactly what I mean, though. There was something wrong with the dynasty they were from the the oh, okay i gotcha oh like they were like labeled wrong we have uh, actually we have some in here Oh, these hats, not the bamboo hat, those other hats. Uh, uh, where do they go? You mean the, the Ming Dynasty hats? Because I, I think they said Tang Dynasty, right? I don't know. I don't know where they are anymore. They were here. Well, they were in one of the boxes. I don't know where the boxes are. Whoa, little P. All right, one sec. Let me give a little Pierre tree ball. Soapy got her hops back. Yeah, she's been doing that. I've been trying to keep an eye out so that when she, when uh, my desk is up, I try not to let her jump up that high in case she falls or something. 
Could be dangerous for her. <laughs> so let's see, where are those hats? I wore one. I didn't like how it looked, to be honest. They should be a Luna. Okay, in the middle. Okay. What? Where did they all go? They were here. We had some hats. Did they like get removed or something in the game? Because they're not there anymore. And I'm very confused, Sweeney Todd. Are you saying you're a scum developer? I'm super confused. What do you mean the hats you put in? Explain. Please explain. I put some of those hats in the community chest. Yeah, there. I don't. I don't see them. I don't see them. Not the straw hats. The other hats, though. Like the rounded ones. She's glad that just now, the first time I saw her do that. Yeah, yeah. She's done before. But yeah, she's. She, she, she can jump pretty high. She's. She got the hops, like you said. <laughs> she got the hops, like you said. Yeah, the rounded ones. Yeah, I don't. I don't see them anymore. Did we. Did they disappear from the game? Have a look in my box in my car. Yeah, like I certainly didn't take any, so I don't know where they went. The hell's your car? I crafted a couple of Sweeney Todd in uh, in my cabin. That uh, twenty five megabyte uh, hotfix must have removed them. I think so. Yeah, they're not here. You just got a couple shirts and you got a hand fan. Can I borrow this hand fan for like a second? <laughs> what the hell does it do? Looks like I'm just holding it. Badly, weirdly. doesn't even open it doesn't open though what can you do with them what do you do with them <coughs> hey baby the fan keeps you cool and hot just by holding it in my hands vertically closed That's what I think of your gift, Greek. <laughs> Just kidding, kidding. What? The devs stole the hats? Yeah, I think they're gone. A stylish Chinese accessory used to keep yourself cool during hot summer days or for a sassy posing towards friends or foes. All right, so let me let me pose here. Let me get up on here and do a pose. There's nothing about opening the fan and doing stuff. Nothing about a fan here. Yeah, 
I think so, Creepy Taco. Yeah, I think so. Uh, Creek, so are, are you giving me this fan? If so, I'll take it. I'll take it. Or if not, I'll put it back in your thing. Mm. Yeah, they're gone, though. They are gone, though. But yeah, they were, they were these hats that look like this hat. Let me see. Let's see if we can find it. The Qing Dynasty hats. Like these ones here. Like this like circle one, this rounded one. I guess. Maybe. Maybe. Mandarin hat? I don't know. Mm -hmm. uh, Bob, what would you think about the, uh, what would you think about if there was a DLC for this game that made all the puppets into the Chinese zombies? What do you think about that, Bob? <laughs> what do you think about that? I'm in. I would buy that. I would buy that DLC. I would be- I would be into that. Yes. The Chinese hopping zombies. I think they were the ones that caused offense to some. I don't know. Okay, I'm Chinese and I don't speak for everyone that's Chinese, but I don't know that I was offended. But uh, if they're the, like the wrong dynasty, the wrong, like if they're labeled incorrectly, they should be corrected. I don't know that I'm offended. Necessarily. Thank you, Krieg. All right, well, there we go. Tabby's offended. Uninstall the game. Refund. Get a refund. Immediately. The square hats with the horizontal flaps would have been better. <laughs> I know. I know the ones you're talking about. Bob. <laughs> oh, let's see if I can get a picture of this. Hold on. Let's see if I find a picture of these the flappy things that you're talking about. I don't even know what they're called. Okay, here we go. Uh, this doesn't look as good as what you're talking about, Bob, but yeah, this one, this this hat, right? Talk about this hat. <laughs> they like, they flap too. Not in the cartoon picture here, but they do flap. Let me see if you find, find a picture, a, a better picture of it. Oh, I found a picture of you, Bob. Bob, I found a picture of you. Actually, I found several pictures of you. I found several pictures of you, Bob. But these are really good, actually. I'm I'm just curating it before I show it on stream. So just give me a second here. <laughs> Let me just look at these real quick before, just in case there's something weird. Okay, these are all actually pretty good. All right, here you go, Bob. I found many photos of you here. This is old man Bob right here. The first picture is old man Bob. Look how long that is. It's like whiskers. 
That's old man Bob right there. No, that's <laughs> current day Bob. I think this is what Bob looks like right now. I think this is Bob right here. You can't see me pointing at the one I'm talking about, but this one right here. That's Bob right there. I'm convinced that's him right there. Hopefully I didn't find the lion dance. Oh, I, I'm keeping that to myself, Bob. I'm keeping that to myself. And there, there's Adam right here. <laughs> this is Adam. This is Adam right there. <laughs> With a mustache. He's got the mustache. <laughs> this is this is uh this is Tubby with his confused face. Yes, Tubby, I'm throwing you in here too. Tubby's uh confused face on this guy. <laughs> <laughs> These shoes look so uncomfortable. They look there's they're only $139. Free shipping worldwide, guys. Free shipping worldwide. Is anybody buying these? This has got to be a scam site. I'm probably getting scammed right now, like hacked while I look at this website, I swear. You have great fashion sense. <laughs> oh, th this one looks awesome. I think this looks really cool right here, this blue one. <clears throat> looks really cool. Actually, it, it looks like the, those, uh, the Chinese jumping zo zombies. For anybody that doesn't know what I'm talking about, the Chinese jumping zombies, oh my god, you're missing, missing out here. Chinese hopping. Hopping zombies. Can we find like an animated gif with this? Let's see what this looks like. Oh my god. Uh, Bob and Adam, I found, I found, I found a gif of you guys <clears throat> and me. Here's you, guys, and this is me. Get ready. Get ready. Here's Bob and Adam, and that's me in the yellow, warding them off, protecting our base. <laughs> uh, those are uh, really old, like traditional Chinese clothes. Custard. Real, like, traditional Chinese clothing. They're actually in this game? No, Tubby, no, they're not in this game. I wish they were. I was saying if it was like a uh, DLC or whatever, it'd be really cool. Like for Lunar New Year, since they were doing Chinese things. So for Lunar New Year, if they made all the puppets in the game be these hopping zombies, Chinese hopping zombies. I would be into this. I would pay for that DLC. <clears throat> but yeah, they, they, they go around and they hop like that and they have vampire teeth. <clears throat> They're actually kind of scary. They hop around just like that guy. I actually have nightmares just thinking of that right now because I used to watch movies like this. When I was younger. This is creepy. That's so creepy. Very creepy. Chinese cinema is best. Yeah, like 80s and 90s Hong Kong movies are the best. All right, enough for that. Anyway, I thought I thought that was a uh, very nice to come across. Bob, Adam, and my finest hour in cinema in GIF form. I just had to share it. I just had to. <laughs> da 
I'm gonna keep all these uh rags actually. <clears throat> Can rags be too dirty to bundle? Is that possible? I guess I need rope. I have rope. Thanks, Battle, for the pasta check. When <clears throat> he's going to be giggling all night, DT's going to be wondering what she's laughing about. <laughs> we haven't actually, like, me and TT has not, not watched uh, one of those Chinese zombie movies. He probably has on his own, but, but we haven't watched one together yet. Like, I'm probably too scared to watch it. Like, I would get nightmares, I think, if I watched it now. <laughs> Uh, pretty funny though but okay why can I not <laughs> bundle these rags together I have rope I have rags this rag is clean oh, okay I have dirty rags what trash so it wants me to like what you can only bundle clean rags that's some bull. I'm gonna have to go clean all these. Try rag strips. Um, I cut one to a strip and see what happens. Well, it sounds like I do rag strip or rope. Well, clearly that's not true. Unless I didn't have enough rope to do it. Can you use rag strips as bandages still? No. No. I love zombie movies. I didn't know about Chinese zombie movies. Yes, Sasquatch, you should check them out. I don't know if they have any like in modern times like now, but uh the old Chinese hopping zombies from like the 80s 80s and 90s Hong Kong movies Hong Kong cinema movies that's like legit that's where it's at Sasquatch you gotta look that up you gotta look that up M maybe go on YouTube for some uh, clips some highlights we should have a zombie movie watch party Aoi would love that probably on discord Adam, you missed the whole thing. Bob, did you clip all that for for, for Adam? <laughs> he missed all of that. He missed the uh, the gift that I found of the three of us. <laughs> okay, it's good. It's good enough that I have to go find it again. Hold on, Adam. Hold on. I swear it'll be fast. <laughs> fast. Hold on. See if I can find it again real quick. There it is. Okay, here it is. <laughs> <laughs> this is Adam and Bob, and that's me in the yellow, warding you guys off <laughs> from the uh, our base, our community base. <laughs> I have a stomach ache from laughing. I'm like sweating too from laughing. <laughs> no, I was I was saying how because Scum has a Lunar New Year update, right? That I wish they had a DLC that came out with these, uh, the Chinese hopping zombies. For the puppets. Like, it's, like make all the puppets to be hopping. Because that would be great. Yo, Derp McGurk, what's up, baby? Thank you so much for the 12 months, you Derp. How you been? Appreciate your support, Derp. How are you? I think I've seen that movie before. I probably have too, like a long time ago. It's epic. But that's what we we're talking about, Adam, right before you came. My wife and Baker twin went to the Asian store on Saturday last week. Crazy busy. Yeah, well, it's New Year's. Lunar New Year. For uh, a lot of different cultures.
they had mooncakes, but she was afraid to buy one. Mm. I mean, you'd always buy it and not, not eat one, though. Not try one, though. Not eat it. <clears throat> dun, dun, dun. Tools. I'm still clearing out my stuff in case you guys wonder what I'm doing here. I'm just... <laughs> It's got too much crap. Just clearing things out. Antibiotics, blah, 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 craftables. Busy with work, but doing well. That's great. Awesome. Good to hear. Bushman, good knife. <clears throat> great knife, actually. Potassium iodide pill. So hot in here. It's a good laugh, guys. Good laugh. It's a good laugh. Probably put a fishing uh fishing storage unit in the garage over there for you, Bob. Having health strengthen your abs. Attune one. Perfect. Perfect. All right. I think we cleared most of this crap out of uh, my chests. So I think we're. I think we're good. Hmm. Playing anything these days, derp. I don't think Biggie is here, but uh, I saw that Biggie now uh, owns Hogwarts Legacy. I can't wait till some of you guys get it when it comes out. Like, Owie is getting it. <clears throat> I can't wait till you guys get it and try it out and uh, let me know what you guys think of it. Because I'm interested, but I'm currently not interested enough to pre order the game. <clears throat> Probably. Not yet, at least. Maybe when it gets closer, if some people get earlier access, then if they say it's good, maybe I get it. Because when you pre-order, you get, you know, you get stuff. So might be worth it to do it, but I don't know. Everyone's going to be wizard. At least a few of you guys. Yeah, at least a few of you guys. <gasps> oh, nothing. Not everyone. I didn't think Krieg would. I didn't think it's uh, up Krieg's alley much. Harry Potter. <clears throat> and don't ask me why I think that. <laughs> Put a scope on this car 98.
much scope goes on here? Do we have anything? We only have like one. I don't think any of these are going to work. Nope. None of these gonna work. Okay, we don't have anything that works with us yet. Style of graphics is too old for you? What? Something is too old for Krieg. Unfortunately, Avengers. Wait, I started at Marvel's Avengers, King of Fighters 15, and Civilization 6. Had to take away from DC Universe Online. Unfortunately, Avengers is losing support in September. Yeah, I heard they kind of like tanked Derp Avengers. Uh, I was kind of interested in it, but I didn't, I didn't end up getting it or anything, but, uh, I heard it kind of tanked. The M82 will if you craft a side rail. Do you want me to craft something, sweetie, Todd? Probably... The long one, I guess. I need a workbench. Okay. Alright. Oh yeah, you know what? I remember last time I crafted a bunch of these before. Alright, I'll, I'll I'll have to go somewhere. Yeah, I'll I'll go somewhere to craft these. Yeah, I remember I remember oh wait, we have a thing. Creepy Taco has a uh, workshop at his uh, thingy. At his cabin. He has, he has a, he has a workbench. <clears throat> yeah, he's, he's got a thingy at his cabin. Got a, a, a Barbie and everything. What? He got everything. The rifle rifle is under medium skill. Hmm. Poof. Ah. Oh my god. Bro. Wait, what? Okay, hold on. Okay, wait. Okay, hold on. This one. Oh my god, this one. Bro. <laughs> what are we gonna do with 10,000 of these? <laughs> long, long rails now. Uh, I need to get some bolts. Oh, now you tell me. <laughs> now you tell me. Thanks a lot, guys. Uh, I don't think do we. Ha I don't think we have any. I don't know if we have any RPKs yet. I do have two RPK magazines that I left in here, though. Anyway, well, I'll just put these in here. It's fine. It's fine. They won't go to waste. They'll be fine. It's fine. Just put them in here. We'll be fine. He did say medium. He said something. He said something about medium something. We're gonna have the crafting skill? Yeah, exactly. That's exactly what I was doing. <laughs> that was exactly what I was doing. Yep. <laughs> um, okay. The clothes are so dirty. Uh, where should we put the, the well? The water well? Where do you guys want that? Right now it's just in the middle, but where do you guys want it?
Yep, I'll repair it too. My guy hot. My God. Should we put the well like here, maybe? Where these wheelbarrows are? Like here? I don't know if it'll fit because it goes up. But uh, put it here or put it here. I guess I could put it here. Here or here, doesn't matter. I'll put it here somewhere. Or here, here, I don't know, somewhere, somewhere over there, I guess. Yes, okay. Okay. Should fit though, it's not that high. Hotel creepy, nice. Yeah, Creepy Taco added this earlier. Check it out. His house is like, dude, legit. Not fussed. Got it. That's like Australian term. I've watched a video, Krieg, so I'm on to you. Know what you're saying. <laughs> but check this out. It's pretty cool. He just added this today. Like this, like this afternoon. Very nice. Very nice. He's got brick. Bro. Nice. Whoa. Do what? It looks so cool in here. Kind of reminds me of Camp Castle. <laughs> Dude, it's so cool. It actually looks really cool on the inside. I like this. It's got a metal door and everything. That he forgot to close. I'm seeing a trend, Creepy Taco, that you, you, you forget to close doors. That's okay. I'm gonna close it for you, though. Because I love you. Gotta do some upgrades. Should be a brick level. Should be at brick level by weekend. Nice. Yeah, it looks great. Looks great, Creepy Taco. Looks great. Bob, you gotta you gotta up your game here if you're gonna be next to if you're gonna be living next to Creepy Taco. I close you close my door. Thank you. <laughs> Wait, what am I doing? I'm gonna craft a couple of these. Creepy Taco, you're increasing the value of my cabin. <laughs> yeah, ain't nobody blown that thing over, Bob. <clears throat> We'll mix up some of these and I'll put them in the cabin for whoever, uh, the cabinet storage for anyone that wants it. Who wants them? Carpet peel, probably worth a million if it were in Toronto. Ooh. That's it? Okay, real question. Do people actually wash their clothes? Because it's gonna take a lot of soap. Because my backpack is really gross. My jacket, my pants, my shoes. Do you guys really actually wash your clothes? Because everything's looking real nasty for me. Should I actually spend time to go wash? Is it worth it? Actually go do, do it, do that. Because it's really gross. Like my backpack looks really bad. 
I think if anything, I want to wash my backpack. I don't like my backpack looking like that. In real life. Only if they're radiated. Wash my clothes when I get affected with radiation. Yeah, I'm, I'm asking about real life, guys. Do you guys wash your clothes in real life? Do you use the washer or do you hand wash? I'm no, just kidding. <laughs> no, no, no. Yeah, in game. It takes so much soap to watch it, wash anything. Ridiculous. I'm not gonna wash my stuff either, but just my backpack though. I, I don't like looking at my backpack. It looks like it's got like uh, patches all over. It doesn't look very good. I hate it. Haven't been anywhere near where the water. Oh, I just washed down where the creek is between here and the town. That's down there. Just easy. Just take off my shoes, my pants. I don't have any socks already, so. I just get in there. I get the soap from the police station. Whoa, nice. Thank you, Sweeney Todd, for letting me know that scope goes on there. Can go in there. Can go on there. All right. Uh, is that everything? Can we finally go loot something for fun now? Ugh, nope, not everything. I still got a bunch of crap here. I got an M1 clip. I'm keeping that shit. I'm keeping that. Sorry. I have a question. Here's a question. Not the P223. I don't have a P223 though, Bob. I don't have one. And there isn't any here. There's no P223 here. These are the only ones we have. So I, I don't know if it does or not, but I don't have one though to try. The Royal Creek? Um, what the hell was my question? Well, I guess I don't have a question anymore. Shit. Because I don't have a question anymore. What the hell is my question? No, not that question. That was earlier. Ricky, what's up, Ricky? Thanks so much for the follow. I appreciate it. Hope you're having a great day. Thanks for stopping by. Clip that brain fart. Pop. <laughs> what the hell was I going to ask? Oh my god. I'm losing it. <sighs> oh my god. We're losing it. We're losing it. We're losing it. 100% losing it.
Well, maybe you remember what she was thinking about earlier. You may realize. Well, maybe I'll come back. But it was like I, I was looking at this uh, this stupid suppressor, but it had nothing to do with the suppressor, though. I don't think. I was looking at it when I thought of the question, but it has nothing to do with it. So, never mind. I guess I don't know. Nothing. <laughs> never mind. Never mind. Never mind. Well, there we have it. There we have it. ARP, come sponsor me. I don't know. Uh, oh yeah, my, my bow is probably in the... In my uh, thingy still. My cabin. Fishing, edibles, stuff. I got too much stuff still, though. Okay. Okay. All right. Okay, we're done. We're done organizing my stuff now. Oh no, this is extra. Okay, we're done though. We're done though. Uh, crafts, tools, edibles, stuff. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Can I ask what the stream is about again? <laughs> you too, Krieg. You too. All right, anyone take take these if anyone wants them. I have no idea what I was going to ask. I don't think it's going to come back, Bob. It's probably not going to come back. You guys haven't watched me dick around in my inventory for four hours, just so you know. For like basically four hours. Pretty much the only things I've done today. For me, uh, it's expected for that problem. <laughs> Thanks, Bob. And it's been funny? Great. I'm glad I provided entertainment for you guys, at least. I was actually, uh, I wasn't sure if it was going to be super boring if you guys were just going to watch me, like, do nothing this whole time. And I was sure it was going to take me a very long time to do nothing. All right, I think I'm done with that building. Um, I want to build stuff in the garage. So, uh, I discussed this with Krieg earlier already, but, uh, I think we're going to make these into double doors here so that we could fit a car in because Creepy Taco said it would be pretty cool if we could drive a car in here and resupply like car things. So I'm going to build these big storage things here like this and line, line them up against the walls here, like all the way around. And, um, and then we have space in the middle for cars to pull in and stuff. Clapping cheeks. What's up, clapping cheeks? Thank you for the follow. How are you doing today? Can I just the door frame? Uh, would you like me to do it? I can. Would you like me to do it? 69 to type 69 in chat to confirm that we are destroying this door frame. 
Doing well, just like to support scum streamers. Thank you so much, Cheeks. Appreciate that. Hope you're having a great day. Thanks, thanks for coming by. I appreciate that. Appreciate that. Thank you. Are you also a scum player too then, Cheeks, I assume? All right, destroying. And uh, this, this is gonna give me PTSD, Krieg. And I can't believe we don't, we didn't have anything clipped or anything for that, Krieg, but uh, s s uh, some of you guys might remember, and I know Krieg definitely remembers this, but when he and I were building one of these big uh, medium cabins in the past, what the hell were we doing? Like we were building something, I was just inside building stuff and Krieg was doing whatever he was doing like building things or destroying things or whatever and all of a sudden the entire exterior structure of the cabin poof went away and we had spent hours crafting it like you, if you've built one of these cabins before you know how long it takes you know it takes a lot of resources to build to cut things down find resources whatever you know how long it takes to do this and all of a sudden, poof, the big cabin just disappeared. But with everything inside still there though, like all of like all my storage, like wardrobes and stuff, they were all still inside. But just the exterior of the building just glitched and disappeared. We were laughing for a good, good five minutes there. And I can't remember if we actually had to destroy everything inside to do it all again, because it wouldn't fit over the, uh, the other building. I couldn't remember that. But uh, the whole thing just, just disappeared. Oh yeah, you know what it was? It was a uh, creek was building um, a foundation, like floor foundation, like next to it, like the platform that stuck out. Like what, like if we if we had uh, a uh, foundation like uh, you know like this or something, and he you know put it down or whatever like that, and I was inside the building doing stuff, and he you know went like to go like this to destroy the blueprint or something. When he did that click, the whole damn thing disappeared on us. It was actually really funny and really sad at the same time. I really wish we had that clip because that was like an epic glitch. That was extremely epic. It was crazy. I would have rage quit. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That would have been uh, warranted. Yeah. Admin hacks, yeah, that, that would have definitely called for admin hacks, I think, Seaside. For sure. You should see my castle. Just about done, but I've been playing Battle Royale uh, servers lately. Oh, I, I, I've tried a couple of those, actually. Like like one or two of them, Cheeks. The Battle Royale servers uh, in Scum. They're kind of interesting. They were kind of fun, kind of janky. I, I thought it was really interesting. That was That was like my only time playing PvP, though. It was my only time playing PvP. Uh, okay, so I'm gonna destroy this. So, so that that's kind of the lead up here. So when I destroy this, if the whole thing disappears, then we know that glitch is still there. Fingers crossed. Well, <laughs> it didn't destroy uh, the whole building, but <laughs> it destroyed partial. It destroyed partial. So, uh, okay. I will be, oh my God. Uh, yep. So we'll be working to repair this. Oh my God. Don't try to do what I'm doing. You'll get stuck there. So uh, we'll be uh, repairing this roof creek as well. Uh, rip. Press F in chat for this roof, please. <laughs> that was a load-bearing wall? Yeah, apparently. Oh my god. <sighs> fix it. So, this is big enough, right? This should be big enough? For a car? Yeah, it's big enough for a car. Is it big enough for the truck, though? If we ever get the trucks back, we'll, we'll, we'll deal with that. <laughs> Sunroof. Wanted more sunlight? I did, actually. Oh, good. My, uh, my torches are still there, so they didn't screw up my torches. That's good. <laughs> Lucky the rest of it didn't disappear. <laughs> oh my god. This game. Alright, let me just... I'll, I'll build this out for you, Krieg. 
bang this out real quick here for you. Roof. Okay, no. Thanks, Creek. <laughs> Have a good day and great stream, ma'am. I'm just making my rounds today. Sounds good, Cheeks. Hey, thanks a lot. I appreciate you show showing the support and uh, coming by and uh, dropping the follow. Appreciate it. Have a great rest of your day, Cheeks. I do hope to see you again sometime. Have a good one. Pretty sure we got sticks here. How many do we need? Four. <laughs> Will many ever go looting today? Well, I went looting already, Creepy Taco. I went in the beginning of the stream. I just went uh I went down the street to do something. I forget what it was, but I did something real quick. I did do something real quick. I didn't get much, but I did something. Oh my god, it's so hot in here. I'm really sweating balls. It's probably 85 degrees right now in my office. Guaranteed. I don't know why it gets so hot in here. I mean, I know why it gets so hot in here, but it shouldn't be. Adds value to home, the, uh, what, the, the, the skylight? Temp outside at the moment. What is the temperature? Who, me? It's not hot out. It's cold. It's 42 degrees out. 10 miles per hour. 42 degrees Fahrenheit converted to Celsius. <laughs> All right, more rope, please. My office temp? Oh, okay, okay. No, too warm. Too warm, Krieg. I'm literally in shorts and a tank top. And I cannot. I'm literally just sweating. I should have had the big fan on, though. I have the little fan going. Not enough air. I got the, the double door frame fixed up, crafted up. How, how why is my dude so hot? He's fine. Who also needs a, an AC when you have a hole in the roof? It's not just a hole in the roof, Sasquatch. It's it's more than a hole in the roof. Much more than a hole in the roof. Much more. We're looking at high 90s and over 100 for the weekend. Heat wave. So, Krieg, when it gets that hot out, do you still go outside to do chores? Like, out, outside chores? Or do you just stay indoors? Okay. Uh... So I think we can fit only two of these in the back, probably. Ugh. Okay. 
Yes, we all get to watch OCD take over here. Sure, seen that's that's why it took me 69 hours to do the other room. All those storage units. I had to make sure everything was like lined up as straight as I could get it. Bolts and planks. We're just going to do one right now. Eh, no logs. Oh, God, we need more logs. There's like no logs anywhere here. Oh, logs here. Thank God. Those other three down there, though, are empty of logs. Those three. Turn outside. I don't go outside in the winter. <laughs> no, there are plenty of hot logs. Little P showed me earlier and me out like a crazy cat. I got logs in the car next to my ramp. Ugh, it's too far away, Kruby Taco. Come on. That's too far away. Nothing. Nothing. Other than Creepy Taco's banjo. You gotta build up your strength, you guys too scrawny. Yeah, I'm just gonna have to carry him. It's fine. It's fine. You do have logs there. You're right. I saw them earlier, Creepy. You're right. It's alright. I'll just carry them. I gotta build up my muscles. That's right there, Green. <laughs> Where are the damn logs? It's right there, idiot. <laughs> I'm gonna use a chainsaw on this. We got a lot of chainsaws in there too. <clears throat> so what should we put in this uh the garage space? I'm thinking gas cans, car stuff, gardening stuff, fishing stuff. And what else? I kinda wanna like outfit it like a real garage, like put out outdoor things there. That's kinda what I'm thinking for this garage space. <clears throat> what do you guys think? Adam, you clipped that. Nice job. <laughs> you gotta put that on the uh, in the Discord clips, Adam. <laughs> Very nice. Thank you. That's exactly what I was thinking. Well. pass out he seems very hot how's that how's that how's that
I gotta grab my uh, yeah, naked building. I gotta grab my uh, toolbox too. Gotta do what I gotta do, Bob. second one since we're since we got a lot of planks cause the main cave sure why not God, I can't fit them all next to each other. I'm gonna have to try my best here to not get annoyed <clears throat> with how they fit in here. Looks pretty good. What's up, Shadley? How many hours in game? Hello, how are you, Shadley? Newbie friendly. Uh, you mean the chat is newbie friendly or you mean the game is newbie friendly? I have 700 hours in the game. I think that plank's in the way. Nah, it's fine. It's fine. <clears throat> is this game newbie friendly? Uh, it has a steep learning curve, but uh, everybody's got to start somewhere, I think and you could always ask people too i'm sure a lot of people will be happy to help for sure all right i think i'm having i'm getting hypothermia now <laughs> put my clothes back on i'll leave my vest off though I downloaded a while back and had a hard time figuring out I'm a Tarkov man. Uh, I, yeah, I, 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 I gotcha. I gotcha. Um, when I started, I had a hard time too, to be honest, but, uh, our, our community is really helpful in helping with stuff. If, uh, if you ever have any questions, feel free to come back and, uh, ask, ask anything. We'll, we'll, we'll do our best to help you for sure. And, uh, we have a, channel dedicated specifically for scum in our discord so if you have questions you want to post in there too while we're uh you know not live or whatever you're welcome to do that as well i'm sure uh, there are many of us here at this point <clears throat> that have played this game enough where we could absolutely help someone that's brand new for sure 100 percent. i i for one would be more than happy to help i'm sure at least a few of you guys other people would be happy to help as well but uh, yeah if you have questions feel free to feel free to ask Feel free to ask. I know a lot of things are not like intuitive. It's kind of like if you know, you know. If you don't know, you don't know. And you just don't know. Thank you so much for that follow, Shadley. Appreciate that. <clears throat> well, uh, we're going to make it your job, Bob, to build the sign then. For uh, the garage. The men cave. You PvP a lot or mainly just build and maintain? <laughs> I don't normally build or maintain, uh, but I am helping up with building the interiors of our buildings here. So so this is a PvE server. Shally, this is a private PvE server here that uh, I'm playing on. And uh, our builder has built the exterior of these buildings and uh, I've taken upon myself to build the insides. So I'm building storage for us. I'll build the other side too. But uh <clears throat> other than that, I, I don't I don't build things. 
But I, I build all these storage units. There's a lot of them. It took a long time. I don't particularly enjoy doing it, but it's fine. I don't hate it. But uh, we all contribute because this is a community-based server playstyle. So we're all here to, you know, share loot with each other, help each other out. Just casual, casual fun here. Tubby for anything related to scum? Yeah. Tubby definitely plays so much scum. He's like, I literally can't get him to stop playing the game. It's like the only thing he plays. That's a joke. That's a joke, Shadley. Inside joke. He, he hasn't really had much time to play lately. That's why we're saying that. Looks dope. I mainly want to redownload to see how it looks. I built a new PC. My old one was a potato and this game looked bad. Oh, this game, this game looks great on a system that can handle it. Like, there's a lot of intensity. Like, this game is intense, I think. But this game looks great if uh, you have all the graphics and stuff set to high, ultra, whatever. <clears throat> this game looks amazing. Sounds amazing. Looks amazing. But uh, depending on when you last played um sh uh shadley there's uh new stuff that that's in it like new updates like with this building stuff that we're doing it's all modular new bait building stuff cars are all modular as well so you can find pieces of the car like car doors the hood the tire which you couldn't previously do that but you can now and now you can like freely build well for the most part you can freely build uh buildings now too base building stuff whereas before you were restricted to you know just the blueprint of particularly sized cabins but now you can build up i think maybe seven 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 levels up or something like that we haven't obviously built up that high so not 100 percent sure but something like that but you get a little more free reign with building a lot more free reign We really wish you could dump out these stupid nails all at once. The pooping and peeing sounds are amazing. Yes, they are very realistic as well. <laughs> They're also very realistic. We need more planks. Been over a year, maybe even close to two. Oh, wow. Yeah, I, I've been playing this for, uh, what, two, two years? Couple years? Two and a half years? But yeah, there's, there's a lot of stuff. There's airplanes. Well, not right now. Sorry. I retract that. I retract that. There are no airplanes at the moment. There were airplanes, but then there aren't anymore. They kind of like took out a lot of the vehicles right now so that they could update it to be modular. So right now there's only two vehicles. You can still make an improvised wheelbarrow, which is what we have up there on the uh, our little porch there. But there's two different vehicles right now, but they'll be bringing them back in. They're, you know, as you know, it's a ongoing, ongoing game that gets updated frequently. Things taken in taken out and put in all the time. Should we just build this whole th storage out? May as well make it a uh, base day. A uh, st stay at home day. For us. Bang this out real quick. Shouldn't take long though if I uh, just do this. No. 69 hours another 69 hours <laughs> Is 
Ugh. See, we have this set up as a community area. So this is the community base building where we have all of our guns and food, ammo, all that stuff are in there. And the little side building is our going to be our garage, which we just built up. And these are uh, personal cabins for people that are here. A uh, random junkyard that we'll move or something with, do something with. And our awesome cool double doors with the creepy tacos junkyard over there. Well, no, don't repair it right now. Let's go, skinny boy. I have to upgrade these uh, twigs too at some point to match the other building. Oh, hmm. We can make this into a different, uh, different material than the normal building, though. So it doesn't have to be the same material. Look how I left the uh, construction hat on, still, Bob. Yeah, maybe concrete, yeah. Whoa, you can see my butt. <laughs> see my butt crack. <laughs> Construction has to save you, that's right. <laughs> that's funny. Okay. All right. I want to do the other ones back here. We can fit two here, I think. Hmm. Are those facing the right way? They're facing the way I would like it to be, yes. I want I want these to be different. same height though i'm kind of confused i can't get this to like these two poles in the middle the sticks i can't get them to no they i i no yes they they are facing wrong direction backwards but i i want them to be backwards i want these to be different uh but they're like not the same height though which is strange
I do appreciate you guys getting my OCD in check just to make sure so I don't waste supplies, but... Are they not the same height? I guess they're not the same height on this, on this one either. Okay, well, whatever, I guess. If you have a lot of time to waste Shadley, this is a great game. If you want to get lost in a game, being completely OCD, organizing things and putting things complete, like try to make, make things straight, as straight as you can. This is a great game for that, by the way. Just like almost mindless doing things. This is a great game for that, I think. As well as, you know, getting uh, scared by puppets in pitch black nighttime when it's uh, thundering and pouring rain like cats and dogs that's uh you could be here for hours just doing this like we've been here for five hours now almost just doing things at the base so these ones i want them to be the drawers the ones on the sides They're not even. I'm gonna have to move this over. And the angle sometimes makes it really hard to see things too. This one has like half an inch too much on the right space. Do you think anyone will notice? Other than me. This is like literally this gap here. There's like half an inch of a gap. Too much. It's a little too big gap for me. <laughs> Not just kidding. I'm just going to screw it. Yeah, construction workers hate doing in interiors. Yeah. Yeah. So I've been charged with in interior. So. Ugh. All right. It's fine. We're going to go with this. Forget it. We're good. Ain't got time for that. We can bang this out. We got this. We got this. Concentrate. Concentrate. Bolts, nails, full box. Bolts, nails, and full box. Thanks, Bob. Oh my god, that gap is so big over there. My, uh, my wall angels, Bob, I will have you know that uh, they've actually gotten better since me starting to do these for two weeks now. Like my, uh, just the uh, position I'm in. <laughs> yeah, the position I'm in, it's a lot better. It's a uh, more like proper form, I guess, if you will. Like you're supposed to keep basically like your butt, your your back, your shoulders, 
your elbows and your wrist all flat against the wall when you do the wall angels which is actually like actually really hard unless you have really good posture and i for sure don't have good posture which is why i'm doing these so if you ever try like try for yourself literally stand up behind a wall and just hold your arms like this and try to get everything to touch the wall like basically your lower back your hip your butt basically touch the wall lean up against it don't arch your back like this just try to stand straight but have everything aligned like your head also the back of your head also touch the wall it's pretty hard if you don't have good posture already at least like for me it was really difficult like and then you just go up and down like this slowly it was super hard for me at the first week and it still is right now but it's a lot easier and i have much better form doing it Oh my god. All right, we're almost there. We're more than halfway there. Uh, we're halfway. I was thinking we could also build like a like a watchtower, but honestly, I don't think we need to cuz once we get off the roof right here uh in the building, like above the building here, it's uh it's already high enough we can see everything because now you can aggro the puppets with your car like just the sound of your car whereas before you couldn't really aggro them once the modular stuff came out like that stopped happening but now you can so when you uh, start up your car when you get ready to open the doors be careful be careful and watch out because they be coming I find the aggro range for your car is a bit too wide. Yes, I agree. Yeah, I agree. Yeah, it like triggers like them from really far away. I mean, I guess your car is kind of loud though, unless you have an electric car, like in real life, I guess too, but I don't know. Like I was driving through Samabor City earlier. So like I said, see, I did loot earlier today. I looted that, I looted that uh, cargo drop actually. Um, when I drove through there, there's I had so many puppets on me. I probably had like 15 of them. But the old cars didn't aggro that far. Yeah, I agree. Yep. I don't think there's anything I can do about it though, unfortunately. Well, uh, if you guys play the rest of this week like this weekend or whatever let me know what you guys think of the loot modifier since it was at 10 before this week and now i have it cut it down to five but i think i probably wanted to drop it to actually three but i didn't really loot today so i don't know if that's too much or too little because i i think they must have changed the settings through one of the uh, updates it must have reset what i put on there because i'm it definitely didn't put 10 but uh let me know if you find if you're finding things too easy if you're not finding things like let me know what you think and we can readjust thanks bob Get ready for that butt crack. Oh. Well, we have any gas? Is it empty? Nope, we're not empty. Oh 
my god. Hello? Oh my god. We can do it. Wow. We can take it to Creepy Tackle Shop. Maybe. Oh my god. There we go. What? I can't hear you, gnome! <laughs> what did you say? I almost put it the wrong direction. What? Why is it like glitching through like the pole? Hold on, it's too far in. Hold on. I'm gonna turn off this chainsaw in a second if this doesn't... What? This, see why this took me a lifetime doing it in the other room? None of the shit like lines up or anything. All right, we're just going with this. We're just gonna go with this. Say if we're missing one more plank, but we're not. We're all planked out. Let's go. Alright, almost there, almost there. Home stretch. Just 69 more nails or bolts. And we need a new toolbox. Smell that chicken cooking, the chicken in a bag. Smells so good. Hey, creepy taco's back.
We can do it, baby. Whoa. Guys, I don't chains are up there. Nice. Alright, we got this. Here we go. It's the final countdown. Oh, I better put some clothes on. My dude's cold now. All right. Last one. One more. Here we go. Cooper Taco, I appreciate you getting dressed. I don't want to assume anything. I don't want to assume anything, Bob. Come on now. It's 2023, Bob. Don't assume nothing. <laughs> All right. This is it. This is the one. You got this. Here it is. Let's go. Oh, I'm fine staying by my cabin. Probably need binoculars anyway from that far. You're too far away. You're gonna need binoculars. All right, we got two extra planks. There are some weirdos out there. Who are you calling weirdo? You mean the weirdo that drove you to the car earlier? Or you mean the ones outside of the base? Whoa, we got more over here. Okay, well then. GG. Everything went really well today, except uh, where we broke the roof like this but this is actually kind of cool you know what I also wish you could do I wish yes you can creepy taco go ahead uh I wish uh I wish we could put glass over this that would be something right if you could uh craft uh glass to put over this or whatever whatever something like that yeah yeah that'd be pretty cool Let me, uh, I'll bring this over to you, Creepy Taco. <laughs> Work on my crafting skill. you do maybe maybe even a greenhouse yeah well, that'd be really cool yeah for like the garden yeah that'd be really cool i wonder if that would be something in the future That'd be pretty neat. Uh, okay, so maybe we'll get a well set up here some point by the building. Maybe, maybe not. But uh, we built this today. This little side thingy with the stairs that go up. We built all these torches. We also broke the roof here. Ooh, the rip. Oh, Krieg. I just noticed we broke the uh, veranda as well. Rip. I just noticed that. Sorry. My bad. Sorry. Rip. Really bad. But, uh, 
Uh, we'll have to build a shrine, f shrine for a little pee up here where we can dump our trash, aka uh, stuff that's we don't want, like this uh, bottle, empty bottle. I don't really want that, but don't leave it on the roof for now. And maybe if we're lucky, we'll build like a thunder box up here. All right, all in a day's work. All on day's work. I only broke two of Krieg's things today. It's not bad. Not bad for a day with Minnie. <laughs> ah! Too fast, coming in too fast. Came in too hot. Hey, what happened to my uh, trunk lid? What? Wait, what happened to my trunk lid? Why is my trunk lid closed? I close my trunk lid. At first I thought my, my trunk lid broke. Is this my car? It's my car, right? Rooftop Thunderbox, what every homeowner looks for? As well as you said, Adam, curb appeal. Hey, baby. It all OP, you made it all. You drew it all over my leg, too. I was being nice and closed your car doors. How dare you? That was not a door, that is a spoiler, creepy taco. How dare you! How dare you? How dare you? How dare you? <laughs> hey, baby. Okay, there we go. Okay. And uh, we didn't die today. We didn't get hit by puppets. We didn't crash. We beat Creepy Taco in a race home from where we picked up the car. We don't have to let anyone know that I only beat him because he only has three wheels on his car that he had. But I still beat him. And that's all we need to know. Unfair race. No rules. <laughs> Kirby tacos on. <laughs> Uh, Alright, I'm gonna reach out this toolbox. Forgot about this toolbox and chain chainsaw. Okay. There are no rules to our races, creepy taco. How dare you? Okay. I think that's everything. And the hex bolts. And the bolts. Uh, Bob, I don't know if you noticed earlier, I think I said this already, but I changed some of the names, I updated the names of some of these. 30 out 6, 308, 338, 57, 44, 55, I mean 45. Updated a little bit to reflect what's inside. I'm gonna stay away from Creepy Taco, who's kind of glitchy. He's like super glitching. I hope he's uh actually trying to get out. Hmm. Maybe lo log in and out. He's like super glitchy. Ugh. I'm gonna stay over here. <laughs> I don't want to get glitched myself. Oh, there we go. That's weird. That's super weird. Well, uh, GG. Rip.
Hopefully he doesn't get glitched. Eek. Alright guys, well... Very productive day. Like I said, I didn't die. I didn't die. Car's intact. My dude is kind of hungry, but not that hungry. He can survive without food. Uh, Sweeney Town, I don't know if you're still there, but I forgot to show you my lanterns. Damn it, I forgot to show you my lanterns. But uh, here they are. Uh, you know what I should have done? I should have hung these in, in, the, uh, in the community building because they don't need to be lit up. They don't need to be lit up. Like, they don't need to... Like, they don't need fuel to stay lit. And they stay lit at nighttime. Damn it, I should have just used these instead of built those 10,000 torches. You know what? I can not I can still do that. We need a lot of glue, though. We need glue and paper. So... Maybe we'll do that, actually. Yeah, because then we don't have to... Uh, we wouldn't have to, f to fuel it with anything. I, I Actually, yeah, I think that would be better. Than the torches. Actually. Need soap? Oh, I think someone glitched in. I can hear them. They don't tip for later? Who? Who? Creepy Taco? <laughs> uh, wait, what? Tip for later? I'm so confused. You need soap? Well, we do need a lot of soap. But we also need glue and paper for lanterns all right that'll be something to work on i think so guys if you guys see glue paper don't throw those out we're gonna want some of that and and uh wires we're gonna want some of those mommy mini said we had to have baths mommy mini oh my god please don't call me that krieg please do not call me that Yeah, glue, paper, and wires, please, Adam and Bob, yeah. Well, not, not like 10,000, okay? Not not 10,000, but we do want some glue and paper and wires. Uh, and also continue with the metal scraps, probably. I think Creepy Taco said he needs like 16,000 million, so... For his, uh, for his construction, for his house. So if you guys want to help out on that, he needs metal scraps too, so... That's a tip for later? Oh, okay. I'm so confused, Sasquatch. <laughs> you have metal scraps. Oh. All right, guys, that's gonna be it for us. Time for dinner. What is everyone having for dinner? What is everyone having for dinner? We are having the chicken in a bag stuff. I'm probably gonna make uh, some Chinese vegetables, probably maybe bok choy tips. I think whatever we have downstairs and then game time is at like 7 30 i think snacks baby what kind of leftovers bob come on you gotta tell me that they give me the deets they give me the deets on the de on the uh leftovers but uh, tomorrow guys tomorrow night is friday night also known as community night which means if you guys are around and you guys want to play with us, we're gonna drop hot logs in a war zone, baby, I think. Unless I get super mad tomorrow during the day and when I'm playing during the day, if it sucks so bad, like we're gonna play Apex or something. Apex Legends. I already have Apex installed. Reinstalled. So we're playing something though tomorrow night. So if you guys are around, come by. We'll be we'll be here at 9 p.m. Eastern. I know it'll be a night stream, so very different than uh, my normal uh, weekday during the week streams that are in the afternoons for uh, Eastern Time Zone at least. But uh, tomorrow we'll be here at 9 p.m. Eastern. Hopefully you can join us. Anybody can join us playing whatever game we're playing. Chicken, beef stew, mac and cheese with Sasquatch. Dude, mac and cheese with bacon. I make that stuff not often enough. But uh, mac and cheese with bacon, amazing. So good. I literally just use Kraft mac and cheese, like the box Kraft mac and cheese. I don't know what kind of mac and cheese you use, Sasquatch. I don't know if you're fancy and make like the homemade mac and cheese, but uh, I use the box Kraft singles, whatever. Not Kraft singles, sorry. The Kraft uh, mac and cheese boxes, but with bacon, real bacon, chopped up. 
so good like incredible maybe i'll make some this weekend although i don't know if we have any bacon so maybe not but craft hack and she's with chinese sausage that actually might be a really good idea bob thank you if i try that i will 100 percent let you know bob that sounds like a good idea actually i, I might do that sometime I might do that, but do not overcook the Chinese sausage. Then it gets not good. But I'll actually try that. No joke. I'm going to try that sometime. I'll let you know. <laughs> All right, guys. GG's as always. Thank you so much for your support, guys. I appreciate everyone being here, hanging out. Hope you guys had fun with us today. I did. I'm, I'm happy you guys stuck around for uh, my stay at home, aka stay at the base day today. It was kind of like on the whim that i decided to just do base stuff today but i had just had too much stuff too much loot uh in my car but hope you guys had fun with us i appreciate you guys being here as always we'll be back tomorrow if you guys are new here smash that follow button for us guys and also join our discord if you haven't already come hang out with us show me your food pictures show me your pets pictures i would love to see all of that stuff and if you're also new to scum we got a scum channel in there ask your questions there post your i don't know scum screenshots whatever you want in there just make sure you're not like seaside don't put your food pictures in the ponyo and friends channel which is reserved for your pets only not random meme pictures of animals damn it one day you guys will learn the appropriate channels on discord no not the fitness channel do not put your food in the fitness channel no no <laughs> no no if you don't know where it goes you can put it in general if none of the other categories fit like your thing that you want to post you can put it in general or just direct message it to tubby just dm it to tubby just DM it directly to Tubby and uh, then no one else will see it. Perfect. <laughs> you have some new How dare you, Seaside? How dare you? How dare you? <laughs> oh my god, I, I can't I can't stand here, guys. I'm, I'm dead. I can't stay in here. I'm so hot. All right, guys. Have a great rest of your day. Enjoy the next meal that you're going to have. Hope you have a fantastic rest of your day and we will see you guys next time hopefully tomorrow if not have an awesome weekend and we'll see you guys next time thanks for joining us guys love you all take care guys we'll see you guys bye